Raptors, yeah, the straw hats. And then we're just getting... Imagine, yeah, we're actually getting Blackbeard versus Garp, potentially. We, we, we got Law versus Blackbeard. And we're getting Kid versus Shanks. Oh, my days. This is crazy. And, and, and all whilst this is happening, yeah, we might get Luffy versus St. Jay Garcia. Oh my days! He could be a competent fighter. When you look at this guy, oh when you look days. at all the the the, the Goro says, yeah, they all look competent. They all have scars. That must yeah. be and yeah. and it could possibly be that they are actually older than they look. You know what I mean? Mm. So they could actually be from from you that, know that you know a lot of a lot of theorists here. Yeah, they look at them when they've done the uh, the O'Hara Buster call. And a lot of the videos you watch here yeah, on, on the Gorose, people use the fact that back in O'Hara, which was what, like 18, actually, how long ago was it? Like when Robin was a kid, like 20 years, no, not 20 years, but like 10, 15 years, I think it's been since they've done the Buster call. Not too long, basically, is what I'm getting at. And if you look at the Gorose, yeah, people say, oh, they haven't aged since O'Hara. But I don't even think O'Hara was that long ago for them to significantly age, considering these man's already old. But I don't know. People will say that because what they were theorizing is that um, the Gorose have some type of age manipulation ability. If not an ability, Emu has the ability and is using it on them type of thing. That's what a lot of these guys theorize. Yeah, I mean that that seems like the only thing that that makes sense, but we know it's probably not that. That's too. It could be that, but that seems too basic. Do you hear? What mm, I mean? Yeah. Hopefully, it's something else, and what is definitely age related. It's definitely something to do with long, you know, longing people's life. Or yeah. something. I think I think one of them or someone had lost fruit from someone busting an immortality thing. Yeah, I think so. I feel someone, like in, someone, in, someone in, fought for an immortality in, thing. If not in the void century, at some point someone has done that that yeah, that, yeah, um, yeah. that surgery thing that laws fruit can do. If, if what do, do you mind? Um, do you mind want to go with a national cons- or what's it a, a general consensus theory among, among all of us here? Yeah? And we use the old the old ratings of how you might used to rate the admirals of the first one you see is the weakest. Of it. Is that what we're saying? No, not all the uh, time. Nah, not, all nah, the time. not anymore. Not because, all the time. Because narratively, mm. yeah, a man can just switch it up to where I feel like it's pretty evident that Green Bull is the weakest admiral right now and he was shown last. So <clears throat> sometimes he can just yeah. switch it. I wouldn't yeah, use yeah. that. I personally wouldn't use that as the as a as an argument. Um, but it is. It does I, have credence though because I see Oda, 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 does right it, Oda has Oda has done it throughout the series. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You know, I'm just saying that the particular. Part, but right now, he's not sticking to his normal format. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm just saying that Number particular two. thing that happened doesn't say to me that he's the weakest. Do you know what I mean? No, it actually from says from oh really? Back. Yeah, yeah. Because. Yeah, he actually, if, if I we don't follow, think based on narrative, Tora, and I don't think he's fucking with Kazari. Well, hold on, hold on, based on narrative alone, I see what based on saying, narrative I see what alone, saying. from what, I off, I from based, based on Kwame's, what Kwame suggested, it would mean that Green Bull is the strongest. But obviously, now that we've matured, we know that it's not, it doesn't necessarily have to be that way. You know what I mean? But yeah, but I, I, still think I feel Green like off, stronger off, than, off the portrayal that we got, it's definitely not that way because. Kizaru would not tremble at the sight of Shanks. He would not How tremble. You know? He's big boy Kizaru. He's not about to tremble. Yeah, he well, trembled where, in where the movie. You, I'm hearing where, bad shit about Kizaru in the movie. And it's nah, but listen, listen, already. listen. It, I, really? I heard you've I seen it. Film. I mean, yeah, but it was bootlegged as hell the way I saw it. So, And bad times <laughs> I was on my phone. So a nah, couple but, things um, I missed. Mr. Prince, Mr. Prince, you're forgetting. I'm at, um, at my <laughs> Ruford. I'm, I'm uh, Marie, uh, uh, what's it? Uh, what's it's it? Cool man. It's cool, man. No. Prince, you get me? No, no, see, see, see. <laughs> no but see, see, see. At Marie Ford, Kizaru had his hands up. So that, on a sarcastic one, though. On a, no, on a sarcastic one. On a, on, on a don't shoot me one, fam. Hey. Man, we don't, let's hey. not go back to Did it. You man deep what on Shank said sh- today? On, on a, on a, Did on you a, man deep what Shank said today when it came to my man's arm? 
Not oh, really, God. not not it's really about life. not really about his arm, yeah. But you know when um I think it was Beckman or Yasop said to Shanks, oh um the enemy are gonna be really mad at you for keeping them waiting. Mm. Yeah, I think it was Beckman that said that to Shanks and then yeah, yeah. and then Shanks said to Beckman, It's not you only too. just me that yeah, them yeah, are yeah, angry you, at. Yeah, you too. So so I feel like it might have been Beckman that took man's arm at this nah, point. Oh, no, nah, no, nah, nah. oh, oh, oh. Yeah, because oh. why else would Shank say they're mad at you too? Why specifically nah, 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 nah. you? He said, no, no, no. He if said, they give at, me a flashback. Yeah, that's it. Slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. Let's think about this. Let's, let's think about this because what's it? I hear what you're saying and that's lit, but I think, I think Shank said what he said to Beckman in regards to what Beckman said to him. Beckman just said, yo, they're gonna be mad at you f- um they're gonna be mad at you for keeping them for keeping them waiting. Because obviously they're thinking um what Shank said before that was like basically their man have just been playing with the they've been playing with the youngsters for now and um the youngsters keep them Yeah um, yeah keeping them up in it. So Beckman was like obviously they're gonna be mad at you for keeping them waiting because they're like from <laughs> who's coming here to be scrapping youngsters? Obviously, everyone's trying to see Shanks. So, I think Shanks is saying that to him to say, "Nah, not just me. You too, that you're a big dog as well." And they wait, they wait into, they wait into beef you as well, kind of thing, isn't it? It's not, mm. just, it's not just me. They're coming for. They're coming for you as well. Like, so I think. But I, you know, I, yeah, that's the I, thing. I hear that. I hear. I hear what you're saying. It could lead into this. A little, Beckman took his arm on the last on a, on a last time thing. I feel like. It would be it would be good for kid yeah if it was at least Beckman that did it. because you know for a man to lose a limb that's serious you know in one piece like he didn't bet that on the new age this man fully pulled up thought he was bad yeah lost his arm and it wasn't the captain so it has right, cool. to, I hope it's Beckman All right cool cool but before we speculate yeah because I know John and um um John and, um John and Saint Fist ain't gone but before we speculate yeah. It right now, from the choices of how we just read this chapter, the choices that were laid out, hand over your things and scram, or you lose your life. Mm-hmm. What if you're a kid right now? Yeah, what are you man doing? Kid, kid wants to fight. Like kid, see, if yeah. you, but if your kid, if your if kid right if now, I'm kid. If you, if you're if fighting, I'm kid, yeah. Say if that. I'm kid, yeah. Say, you know the thing mm. about kid, yeah. Kid believes in, believes in himself like he's the chosen one, yeah. And I really want to see kid's flashback, yeah, to understand why he actually thinks, yeah, he can come and fight Shanks's fleet. Basically, it's not I, nah. just one Shanks, you know. It's that's not right. Shanks All right. Cool. That, that's that's a fleet of man. That's why I want don't you man's care. answers. <laughs> that's a that's, fleet. That, that, that is. That's 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 why I want you man's answers. Saint Fist, what if your kid right now? What you man? What you do? Well, if I'm kid right now, I'm ready to fight because I'm kid. You know what I mean? I don't yeah, kid, what... yeah, I, fam, I respect, yeah, the way he's actually on it. Man said, only if I lose. I'm that, like, wait, That's what? exactly what I'm oh, he's not com- communicating anyway. Island, yep. I mean, Shanks is like in the island. This guy is on the ship. No, no, no. He, he, he told Rockstar, remember? Yeah, Rockstar he, to he, he told Rockstar, yeah. Yeah, told yeah, Rockstar yeah, to yeah, yeah, yeah. And then, and then Killer, I think Killer was chatting to him, telling him, family, if this time they won't just take your arm, you know. All right, cool. Yeah, yeah it was Killer. We, it, was kill, it was Killer, it was Killer. We... But, but what's it, what's it? Um, I was going to say, on that last point, yeah. Um, oh, he's got the chapter. On, on, yeah, yeah, yeah. on, on that last oh, point, on that last point, I was going to say, Kid is more of a risk taker. It's not, I don't even think, I don't think Kid went there, believe, or Kid went to Elbaf believing shanks is there i can beat shanks how luffy and law went to kaido's thing to say listen we're gonna beat kaido i think kid stumbled upon this situation and man is just a pure risk taker so he said listen man's gonna man's gotta go this way and it no i'm not thinking of any other plan because the only way they're gonna kill man is if i lose in it so i will take this risk and just jump in but i don't think man's, i don't think he's being brave like oh i knew shanks was there Fuck it, I have to go there anyway. No, so I think he, I think he knew. I think he knew. Oh, but, I mean, oh, actually, you know, he the might panel actually, he where, might have known because you know he chose Elba. Where they arrived at Elba, Shanks had been yeah. chilling there. 
didn't he seem a bit surprised or did he actually you know make make a like like make a beeline for Elba? like did he say he was going specifically Elba? Or yeah, did he nah, stumble he, across he, Elba? No, 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 no. He when, said he was looking when, for the burnt scar guy. So, so I'm guessing it's the burnt oh, scar so guy. Oh, no, no, it's all, it's all, it's all. Oh, from sorry. Robin's, it's, 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 yeah, yeah, it's yeah. all from Robin's flashback, and he's a giant. So, oh, yeah, yeah, that yeah, does make see? sense. <clears throat> yeah, so, it, yeah, so he had to go to Elba. He said, yeah, so when when every man picked their ways, um, Luffy said, oh, let's go this way, whatever, whatever. He looked at Killer in that chapter. He looked at Killer and was like, "Yeah, let's go to Elbaf." Um, and then that's when he was like, "To look for the, um, gonna, um, it's time to, it's time to meet the man with the red hair, um, the burnt scarred man." Or whatever, yeah, whatever. yeah. And he was saying to Luffy, "You don't even know who it is." Da, da, da. Yeah, 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 yeah. But then you know what I'm saying, so he he's just stumbled upon the situation. But I think Kid is just a pure risk taker. It's not even bravery or anything like that. He's just said, "I right, cool. I'm not gonna. T- I can't turn back because I got a, I got a beef him anyway." Oh yeah, I get what you mean now. But I'm gonna take this risk, and if I if I actually bust it, sure. Yeah, lit. I get what you mean. Yeah, yeah, lit. makes sense. So can we start from like the chat? Should we do the previous chat or just this one? I don't mind. I don't mind. the previous. Just this one. Oh, yeah, this one. Yeah, so no, previous so no. I can't be. lie. Yeah, someone give me a quick recap on what even happened last week. Yeah, it was about the lab. Oh, 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 last chapter was about us trying to okay. find out who's the person that's you know the traitor. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. That's the, 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 the cameras, start, yeah. the cameras started going. Who do you mind. not think it um, is? I was telling, um, I was telling Saint Fist earlier. I think it's Dusty. You know, <laughs> it it can't be because. I think that he, he, he me out. He it can't me out because first. Stassi's looking first. as well for That's the perpetrator. And That's the perpetrator is in action right now. And Stassi's That's literally what... with Sanji looking for the person. Mm, I don't know. Maybe maybe in Probably alliance Stassi. or something. Yeah, maybe in alliance or something else. But I think in a sense of... Um, I was telling him this earlier. I was thinking if she, could, if she had the power to... I'm not saying she's stronger than them, but if she had the power to incapacitate Luchi and Kaku at the same time, obviously mm. her, her job was to come out from wherever she was, obviously, which is a place far away, not effing with any of the other Vagabonds. She was basically doing her own thing until she was called upon. If she's been called upon, agree to come out, because obviously she's um, her main duty is to protect Vagabonds' life. She's done that come out incapacitated um Luchi and Kaki. But I think she hasn't killed them because she's gonna be a double agent thing that she's obviously out to protect Vega Pont's life in general, but her main aim is to store, no, man. store Do you know why? Do you know why to, to them I come to the island. Didn't the person yeah who has been doing this bag Vega Punk? We don't know. Oh, oh, actually, yeah, 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 yeah. Exactly. So if that person has put Vegapunk in a cell, it can't be Stussy because Stussy's with Sun. They're looking for the Stella. They're looking for it. No, no, that, that, that's what I'm saying. That's what I said. So you're saying she's a, a double agent where she, 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 she's been fucking up. No, that's, it what, can't that's be her what I was saying. You no, know no, it can't I'm, be her. Well, call me. Just, just, this yeah. is basic. The reason it can't be her, because you know in the chapter last time, uh, last week, where we saw the reflection, yeah, where the person oh. was licking down all the cameras that yeah. physically can't be her because off screen she's with sanji and uh, i think she's with brooke as well or someone else so no, that no, can't no. be I, that, that happened in the same you. chapter no no i'm ag- i'm agreeing with you that it's, it's loose it's a loose theory i was just saying that with those i will, I, will, I can only plug those holes with like I have a theory. maybe uh, I'm, I'm saying i could only i think plug it's, those, i think it's but, one of one of um, I have a theory. the Vegapunks. In my theory, I could only plug those holes with, in the, maybe later, Oda's going to introduce another entity to say she's in alliance with somebody else on the island that's been trapping the prisoners with her or something like that. But apart from that, I just know motive-wise, I think it's protect Vegapunk, but double agent thing to let Kazara and them on country. What, Jonga? Uh, Daryl was just about to probably say it before I did, but um, I think it's one of the Vegapunks. Just basically yeah. the fact that there's six um, satellites, right? And there's meant to be seven satellites because they're meant to be based off like uh, the seven cities, I assume. But right now, there's only six and instead of seven, depending if you want to use the actual oh, main, I think it's a new one. Sorry? I think it's a new robot. 
It could be another robot, another, another one. Because right now, there's only six of them. I don't know if you want oh. to the next one as being the seventh, but if you don't, then there should be another one. I would say, I would say he's separate. Mm. I would say oh, he's separate. If, if it's meant to be separate, then we're still missing another one. And it's yeah. Probably... And wouldn't, wouldn't the last one basically be based off greed? No, there's already a greed one. Who's greed? Greed is... I you know I, I don't know the character designs in it, but there's already a greed one. That's like fat. Uh, no, that, right I'll now say, there's I'll, 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 say, I'll say that I'll say that's gluttony. No, so it's actually on the wiki. So we have greed, violence, wisdom, thinking, evil, and good. Who's evil? So it can't be greed Lilith. then, because greed's Lilith. only there. Lilith is evil. She's my yeah, favorite like, one, to be honest. I, th- I think Lilith. Is, oh, I, I also um, earlier I was also um, telling the same thing. It could be Lilith because she was effing with the sea monsters at the start, so she's the only one we've seen actually chill yeah. with the sea monsters and actually know. And we know that the people imprisoned it's the sea monsters that activated it. Vegapunk didn't know because <laughs> he, 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 he thought he thought they might cut, but obviously sea monsters turned that man back around. Like yo, nah. I mean, I mean, it would be pretty obvious if it was Lilith. She's her aspect is literally evil. You know what I mean? It's, it'll be pretty straightforward. Who do you think yeah. it is, fam? Oh, me? Yeah. I'm not a mystery guy. I'm not. I don't care about who it is. What do you mean, mean you don't care? That's no, as in like, I don't even care. Of course you care. Nah, like, of course I, you care. I don't. No, I don't care. As in like, as in surprising. Like, I'm not trying to look into who Same. it is. Like, like, I don't care about it. Back, of, I literally just thought about it right if, now. If if if, if they come, see see. Daryl, Daryl, um, what's it? Sorry, my bad. Man said. <laughs> hey, first time. If, what's it? If if they come and tell these men that Usopp is the one doing all this, these men will be hair shitting on Oda. So don't come tell me that you don't care. Innit? <laughs> and, no, you're not getting it. That's not what I feel towards the No, no, no. He, 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 means he doesn't it really have an opinion like that. He means it in the sense of he's sitting back and just watching what Oda's going to do. Exactly. Yeah, I want to yeah, no, no, I I I be surprised. I'm not I'm not one Bob, of those ones who's looking through every chapter to try to find out. I read thing. every chapter. I don't, I don't do that. No, I'm not, no, I, don't, I won't do that I'm for this reason. I want to be... I want to be surprised by the mystery like i want to go i'm saying i heard that you know what i mean like yeah i'm, I'm, I'm not no, trying to I'm find saying, out who I'm, it is I'm, I'm so, saying so, so what would a new that, robot that's... yeah that completes a set of seven would that would would that would, like would you take that no nah, i would you I say no hold can i let me answer that quick i would say based on what based on what um John has said that's an outside. That's like a. a hold on, hold on. Why is my name John, but everyone else is Prince and what? Wait, what's yours? Oh, Johnny. <laughs> <laughs> let me let me quickly explain this point. In, 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 in life, everyone else is Prince. In life, we don't Prince. Let me say this based on Johnny's. Uh, based on Johnny's. It's John, theory, man. It's John, man. It's John, man. Yeah, based on that. <laughs> That's like an outside theory. Like, if you're because for me, it hasn't been set up that there's a seventh punk. We're, we're only hearing that based on real world that there's meant to be seven, seven, um, so seven satellites or whatever. Yeah. That's in the mm-hmm. real world, but inside the One Piece world, I wouldn't like it only because it hasn't even been set up. Now, maybe it is set up, but I haven't gone through the chapters to actually see where the setup is. So it could be that there is a setup setup? in there. What? Okay, wait, yeah, okay, John, you, um. I, I would, John, you volunteer one setup. I can volunteer well, another it's one. It's not really a yeah, setup. So if, if it... set, I'm talking about if they set up that there's a seventh punk. Yeah, if there's a setup that there's a seventh punk, I haven't seen that setup in the well, manga chapters itself. I would say the setup would be it's just because when he said there's six satellites and yeah. we know the names of each satellite, you can yeah. tell that this is probably based off the seven series. Yeah, that's what I'm plan. saying. That's what I'm and saying. Based on what you. Okay, so, yeah, based on okay, what so you're wait, saying, wait. is an it's an outside world sort of fact. Okay, now we're that wait, it's um, meant wait. to be a seventh one, but in the story of One Piece itself, and there needs to be a setup that maybe there is a seventh, but I haven't seen any setup yet. So well, if it just it comes, comes out of the blue, hold on. If it comes out of the blue, I wouldn't like it. it I okay, would wait, like. Wait, let me just finish answering okay, this question. Go on, go on. Prince's question. So for me personally, I would want it to be one of the one of the punks. I think that would intrigue me. You know what I mean? I'll be like, oh, I didn't see it. Coming. Yeah, yeah. It was by far. One of the existing. Like, oh, you know a lot of I mean? people think it's Shaka. But okay, well, yeah, yeah. 
Everyone thinks it's Shaka. Okay, wait. So, um, same fist, yeah. Let's let me let me volunteer this situ- um, scenario. So, if if it comes about that it's um, if it if it, if Oda does it in a way to say something like, um, okay, there's six there's six satellites right now, but the seventh hasn't been mentioned so far. So you're right. There's no foreshadowing and there's no setup so far. But if it then comes out that when or just before we find out who's doing it or just when um, we find Vega Punk and we're leading up to he's guessing who could be doing it or Shaq is guessing who could be doing it, one of them. What if it comes out that um, there, there was actually a seventh satellite before, but that satellite was scrapped and that satellite was dismantled and maybe thrown away. It was like in the part that the, that part with the big robot where it should just be things that things that basically are like broken inventions or things that he's thrown away basically. If it's and it's basically put itself back together, reprogrammed itself or whatever, and now it's just trying to F shit up and take over the island or something like that. If it's that kind of setup, would you F with that? Yeah, so that it would depend it would depend on this the distance between the setup and the revelation of that first, of, first. Of punk. Do you get so what I mean? Like yeah, so it's not like it's just pushed on Yeah, so if for example the saying, revelation yeah, okay. was on chapter was on the next chapter. But then, and then we have the we had the setup the, just the chapter before. I'll be a little bit annoyed, you know what I mean. But if the setup was was set up like in a really like, subtle way, like three, four, like three, four like chapters, three, five chapters ago, yeah, yeah. And I'll be like, yo, older, like you're a G. Do you get what I mean? But anyway, let's not waste time. Can we go through the panels one by one now, so we can actually? Yeah, get yeah, to yeah for real. Let's get and, started with mm-hmm. the chapter. Okay, so these man main room. Kaku, Luchi, Hancroft, um, Zoro, Luffy versus the Kuma one and the Hawkeye one, um, Seraphims. First, first of all, yeah, I, I have a problem with this John, just hold it there, hold that panel there. Go on. Yeah, um, I have a problem with this whole interaction. Obviously, we'll get onto the exact words. I think yeah. it's like two two panels after the exact words. That I think the real translation. Yeah, ah, but... So... Oh, you got the real translation? No, not yet. Oh, oh yeah, we'll this, just this go with what we have. Um, but yeah, what's yeah. it? Yeah, um, the problem I have with this interaction here is I see what Odo was trying to do, but later down the line, you see when they do the little funny thing when Luffy saying, "Okay, um, to Luchi, basically, I right, call." Cool, but when um, after we after we waste the seraphims, when you find out you can't beat me, you're not gonna like basically be a waste man and try to go for my friends, isn't it? I don't, I, I don't like that reassurance because think of it in the flip reverse. Luffy's level, Yonko, obviously we know it's a false, it's a false positive in the sense of he's not meant to be there, but technically he's there, kind of thing. But in when he when you're on that kind of level, Luffy's strength level, I feel like him saying. But that's that line, not- I'm not even trying to cut you, but that's coming mm-hmm. up on the panels after, isn't it? Like, what do you have to say about this panel? You know what I mean? The, what are you the saying? Night, now it, it, it's the same conversation, but um, it, this panel, the, the, the night saying that this panel, all they say is um, we're here on it, basically. Nah, no, you know, because we didn't discuss. Situation. Yeah, but we didn't discuss last chapters. So, what do you lot guys think about the CPO jo- um, joining forces with Luffy and Zoro to fight together? Basically, the 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 Seraphins, they're also trying to kill. Luchi I feel and... like I feel like it's it's, you it's necessary up? right now. It's it's necessary because what people are failing to realize here: yeah, these seraphim are monsters. They're actually monsters. Like in yeah, the chapter, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. in the chapter, yeah, Zoro couldn't actually fight and protect Kaku properly because the guy he's dealing with is is a monster. You see this yeah, man's death. Yeah. Yeah, and yeah, he called out. Um, uh, so I feel um, like right now, and you know, yeah, the way Oda's been doing Kaku and Luchi, yeah, uh, especially after how Stussy done them as well, it's like their portrayal, yeah, they've actually come in here like Green Bull, where they came in looking flashy, but then as we as as we go forward with these man, it's like um, their their their, their overall's going down. Fam. These man, these mm-hmm. man, they're going down like. Obviously, so man had them high because in the list, we're in the final saga. So Oda's trying to show us this guy that took Luffy to the brink of death today. Yeah, uh, Luffy's telling him you can't beat me. Like, nah. it's, 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 it's that no, simple. But that, that's what I was. That's we'll we'll, I was, we'll that's get to that though, because I've got a bit of a rant. 
Like, I just need to rant a little on bit. that. <laughs> on, not, not on that, not, not on that, but on just on this panel that? here. On this panel, what? this panel that John is showing us here, yeah. But also, because we didn't see, we didn't, we didn't do a discussion on the previous chapter, so I couldn't mm, rant. Yeah, yeah, then. no, no, just to finish up, just yeah, yeah no, on, I feel like they, 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 they have to team up right now. Obviously, there's only two of them. So we're in a position where you're trying to escape. You know, we've not come here to liberate anyone. They're yeah. trying to escape. Yeah. So just get the numbers, do your thing, and try and cut out here. I'm trying to go, oh, bad. Right. These men need to come out here. So, but the question, <laughs> the question for me now is, is like, whoever's behind this, I can understand that I can understand they're trying to kill um, the Vega punks. But my question also is, why are they trying to kill CPO? Some people feel, theorize that they're actually working for, for the government, but which obviously wouldn't make sense because they're also trying to eliminate the CP, CPO. Then, yeah, you're opening up Pandora's box. because then Pandora's box, yeah, that's then, the whole point. That's because then we're looking at, it could be the Black Bay Pirates. It could be... It could Black be... Bay Pirates, how? It could... Because who else here yeah, is looking for things like this? Like, like I feel like at this point, nah, yeah, but to take control the, of them so quick. I feel like the black oh, oh, in terms of espionage, there's a few people here yeah, that would be interested slash can even do these type of things. And I feel like the black big pirates could pull that type shit off. The uh, the revolutionaries could pull that type shit off. Most yeah. pirate crews can't in do terms it. of in terms of what it's definitely not the, the revolutionaries. CP, definitely CP not agents. the revolutionaries. Yeah, but in terms of espionage, yeah, if it's a faction, who is it? Yeah, it's definitely if, not. If, I don't if, think if it's the black gay faction, pirate. Then, so yeah, I mean, because me saying yeah, that yeah, is that there's no concrete I'm, evidence I'm, behind I'm, it. Yeah, it's I'm just like it's just like who else? No, we're Could talking about who is it that's controlling the seraphans to try to get rid eliminate CPO yeah, and yeah. So that's yeah, what I'm saying. Because, you know, I'm saying, it was a I'm terrible saying how thing could... to see that they're badding up CP uh cipher agents as well. Because that rules out because I was thinking it's whoever's working for Saint Jay Garcia, and yeah, that's why he's coming in. Rules it, out. it can't be that, yeah, it rules it out. So, but, so yeah. but what if SJ Garcia is trying to eliminate Kaku and Luchi because they failed before? But that's a shit theory, I'm just saying. Um <laughs> Uh, because well, you know they've been after them <laughs> when when they failed to defeat the short hats before, before yeah but, yeah but I, and I think that's that's a stupid reason to do that um yeah, what i'm saying yeah. is though um so it's definitely not the blackbeard parrots because blackbeard yeah, parrots they're how, engaged how, how would blackbeard do that yeah because they're engaged with law i, I, I feel know, like you know what i mean one thing about the blackbeard pirates yeah Obviously, I don't know. I don't know. It's just that if anyone was good enough to do it, yeah, this, this, their crew could do it. No, no, see, I, 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 I hear what you're saying. Possible, in, in terms of, possible. no, no, I, I hear, I hear what, um, I hear what Prince is saying in terms of like <laughs> espionage of like spying on the island or like discovering the technology or stealing the technology away. Fair, like those kind of like more basic elements. I, I hear that like the invisible, invisible fruit. Get that steel, um, steel one to several films, maybe like get a, um, um, get something, something. um, what's it? Get judge or a team up with judge or something, make more several films for Black Bears, Pirates, or whatever. Mm -hmm. I hear that, but I'm saying to actually gain control of the several films, the same arc where we've just seen them, that's uh, that's, a, that's a mad stretch to gain control of them now. Uh, that's a mad stretch. Me personally, I, obviously, I don't know who it is, right? So the only person, one second, uh, yeah. I'm thinking it's a faction. Yeah, it's got to be. It's got to be. What well, to be honest, I don't know, man. But if it's a faction, yeah, it's got to be a faction with a relevant head. It's got to be Blackbeard. It's got to be cross, cross guild. Like it's got to be someone because the final saga fan. Like, we're here. Yeah. So yeah. So back to what I was saying. Who I think it is. Um. I don't. I obviously don't know who it is. But if it has to be anybody, I mean, I wouldn't mind it if it was one of the Vega punks. Even um. Can you not hear me? One of the one yeah. of the Vega punks said. I think it was Edison. The, he said that um. I have to. I have to go back to the chapter. It was the previous chapter. But he was saying how. Anyway, one of them said. Put forward how, on the page though. Um, now, because John John is handling this, so I can't really touch anything. Um, 
he was saying how um, he was they've made a massive miscalculation and because of that it seems to me that the problem is it has to do with the Vegapunks themselves so it's very possible that there could be another satellite or oh. or they made a mistake during their experiment or they've just made the mistakes with one of the one of the Vega parts. Yeah, that's, that's just. But that's you know, right. you know, to go back to what John was saying earlier, yeah, you know how you have the greed, wisdom, evil, blah blah blah. What's the one? What's the word that's missing from the thing? Yeah, the John. What's the one missing? The set. Um, what's the actual word for the one missing? There isn't any word because they're not actually <laughs> named after the uh, sins, but it's like its own word. So, we so, 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 you know how you have the glutton and all that stuff, yeah. Like it's all, all of it is there. I, I would have to, like, we would have to try and match up the current names of the, so, oh, not of the, sorry, of the satellites to the, the synthesis. How many of them were there? Because wait, there's no raft. There's no raft, right? Actually, no, there is a raft. Um, mm, it depends nah, on what you want to. This is this isn't the seven deadly sins. Mate. It's not. It's no. not. But. But you think it follows that principle of seven? Yeah. Yeah, because we're using the same exact well, word. Well, they just right? don't have the same name, but it depends on what you want to match with the other. Oh, but you know the thing about Oda? Oda could just switch it, yeah, and just have less and just carry on, like... And just go on with that. Happen. Yeah. Who knows, man? Anyway, let's get into the chapter because, hey, these, these seraphim, man. Ah, uh, you're right. Like I want to talk about how powerful the Seraph because I've been They're underestimating so strong. them. So strong, yeah, I've, man. I've been underestimating them. And uh, monsters. based on a couple of videos that I've seen on how strong King actually is, like you know, we have to give Kings his props. And uh, I'm about to say something that's controversial. Arba. Yeah, Arba, Arba. I'm about to say something controversial, but I can prove it to you guys. I can prove it to you guys on the chapters itself. Do you get what I mean? You're trying to prove his strength now. <laughs> wait, wait, where are you putting him? Huh? Because no, not because... right now. I'm saying when we get there, when we want to when we're ready to talk about the seraphims. No, then... let's just do this quickly. Hold on, hold on. Oh, hold on. okay, okay, okay. Hold on. So wait, hold on. Let me show you this here. Let me show you this thing. Let me because I've got it right here. Mm. It says, um, Edison goes, Edison is that guy with the helmet, zero one. He says, Come on, if man, they won't take two, my please. orders, if they won't take my orders, then there must be act then they must already be acting on a command issued by a Vegapunk. You know what I mean? Between the communications blackout and the barrier sealing us in, this is beginning to seem like an elaborate plan. Somebody is trying to kill us all. Do you get what I mean? Mm. So why would Edison say that? Why would, if it's, if it's a command being issued by a Vegapunk, number one, they wouldn't try to be assassinate, assassinating other Vegapunk. That to me just tells me that there, there has to be one of the Vega Punks is on this. One of the yeah. Vega is behind this. And me personally, I would I'll be um I'll be I'd like it, but we'll see what Oda does in it. We'll see what Oda does. To be honest, if it is one of the one of the Vega Punks here, yeah, I think it'd be best if it's Shaka, if it's if it's Edison. So Shaka. Now, if it's Shaka, if it's Shaka, I wouldn't mind because his aspect oh, is bugger. good, isn't it? Yeah, his aspect is apparently good, but it would be a nice twist. It's not good; it's logic. So he yes. might just feel like it's the winning side, and that's yeah, why he's yeah, doing this. Him, exactly. To him, might be okay. Like in all that, almost like what's his name? What's um from the Avengers? What was that? The second enemy, the the robot enemy. What was his name? Ultron. You know how Ultron mm. thought that the best way to save mankind was to create robots, like an army of robots. It was, that, was, uh, his, that was his motive was just to kill everyone still. Yeah, yeah, because he thought that would be <laughs> whatever. He, he, that, he thought that would be the good for mankind. So that's yeah. his objective version. No, nah, not, not. He, he, said, he said human beings are diseased though. Yeah. Yeah, so that's his subject. <laughs> he said that's good for the world. He's uh, <laughs> killing everybody. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He said, he did say, exactly. He so that, for, that would be, the world, yeah, yeah, so Prince would be right. That would be sort of like his logic. Like, in like in order in order for the world to have peace or be good or whatever, it's, it's necessary that I do this. So that would be kind of his thinking. Because if it was Lilith, that would be like, yo, it would be like... It would just be spontaneous, evil. It, it would just be like, evil, like, okay, like, you know, like, we missed that. But you know, yeah, having said that, though, yeah, I think that's too predictable for Oda. 
for it to be um, uh, Edison. No, yeah, I think it's Edison. too predictable. It's too predictable, it's too predictable, it's too predictable to be Oda's gonna Edison. Like, I, I mean, sorry, different. we keep saying Edison is Shaka. That's what Shaka I'm saying. Is the one with the helmet. That's what Edison. Sh- yeah, Edison Shaka, is the Shaka. thinking one. Shaka is yeah, the one yeah, with the Shaka. helmet. The good. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was bugging. Yeah, I knew it was Shaka. Shaka is. Yeah, yeah. I would, I would personally eliminate Shaka and Lilith because it's too straightforward. Do you get what I yeah, mean? Yeah, it's too easy. Yeah, it's too easy. And, it's too nah, and also, if it was um, um, when I, I was actually thinking Budlan fucking with the um, Shaka theory as well, but if it's Shaka, he wouldn't have just busted me for the keys to free Luchi and Kaku like that, just to dead off the Seraphim. There's no point. Mm. The, whole, the, whole, the whole point he turned the Seraphim was to put them in the situation. Oh, they just bust the keys to them, just like, yeah, yeah, free them, man. <laughs> you might just but, um, exit the situation, help everybody else ASAP. It wouldn't make no sense. But but thinking, when you look at Punk 3, because I haven't gone back to reread the chapters from the beginning. I've been thinking of doing that. But when you think about it, the person who's more likely to think like um, Ultron would be the person who's thinking or wisdom. <laughs> Those two, you know what I mean? Like, yeah thinking and wisdom they might be thinking they're too wise and this is the best solution thinking and wisdom they're suspect but that's just like a speculation they're suspect but i'll have to go back in the chapters and find and look at but you know the man yeah and the man's design problem. is so just out there that man i, I don't even know the man's name yeah, still but i'm not really that type of guy to go back and look so i'm gonna just leave it to order to surprise mm. you, really but Getting into the seraphim though, because what's in front of us is this is uh, what's his name? S Hawk. Uh, S Hawk. This guy yeah. is a problem, fam. Yo, fam. yeah, even has the dice dice fruit. Problem. That's what the dice dice fruit. S Hawk is deep. Quick one. Poor character design. Quick one, yeah. What? Is that? You actually been trying to Do they clone the abilities or do they take the abilities like the Blackbeard Pirates? They're cloning it. What we hope so. They re- they so, recreate the fruit. So 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 Daz Bones is all right. Is what I'm trying to get at. Like, yeah. So yeah, 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 yeah. I used like, to think. I, 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 I think. I think. I think every. I think every seraphim that has a fruit. I think it just means that whoever actually has that fruit at one point was experimented on by the government. So they have yeah. the DNA, they have DNA. I mean, extracts. they were in prison. The arrest is shot today. Yeah, yeah we saw that was, before. Yeah, I was bugging. I don't remember. I saw that shit today. I was yeah, like, oh, yeah, so it's yeah, definitely yeah, got the fruit. Yeah, yeah. That, that man, that, that man can repel on that. It's crazy. But what's it? That's what the point I was saying earlier. Yeah. Hold um, on, hold on, hold on. Wait for wife to come back. Oh, yes, I know. <sighs> well, at St. Fist, you know. Hmm. I don't know whether to call man saint or fist. I guess saint sounds more normal. Yeah, yeah, saint is saint, but don't, don't we call him my fist. <laughs> <laughs> That's a real word. Obviously, I'm, 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 I'm not calling you king, so I was even about to call you pause. But nah. pause, pause has a different meaning now, so we, yeah, I'll just look yeah, mad. Because they don't get the blue coat. They don't get the blue coat. Blue mm, pause is different. It was actually just so you could pause here and just like just wait for a bit. Just, 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 just go hold on, yeah. You go, you know, you go deep, you go deep in for a second, like shit. Yeah, the kids don't get that shit. Yeah. They think nah. pause means you know no home. No home. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. They learn, they learn. Uh, these kids, boy. Yeah, I mean the dice dice fruit though in general is is actually very basic, but I think for this character it's good. But I feel yeah, like yes. being An actual Mihawk's sword clone, is crazy. being Mihawk's clone, yeah, I feel like if he had a better devil fruit, yeah, it would have been overkill. So yeah. I feel like it's calm. He has a little basic little devil fruit. I think I think Mihawk's clone he has the most room for potential. Huh? I think um, Mihawk's clone has the most room for potential. I think um, being Mihawk's clone, he has the most potential. Yeah, pretty much because yeah. genetically he's got the strongest guy in it. Yeah, strongest. literally. I think I think he's I think he's gonna be he's, he's captain still. He's captain. It's you know yeah. I feel like maybe with Doflamingo having royal blood, maybe they couldn't or wouldn't do his. But I don't know. Um, some people say Kuma's royalty royalty in some way. Yeah, but Dofi's their royalty. 
said it's different. Is Kuma, it... Kuma's of a, of a noble bloodline, but not Tenry Bio. Dofi was was actually born as one of them, so they might not want to. But I, but I, I, I won't be surprised if they do, in it because obviously I'll the be virus. Yeah, but they, hey. they, they, they can put him in prison and then build out. Then yeah, it's, it's actually it's all the evil. It's all the evil seraphim that we haven't seen. Crocodile Moria and um, Dofi. That's three nah. evil man. Kuma, nah. Mihawk, um, Jimbe, fucking uh, Boa. These are all good seraphim. Like the, the real characters are good people. No, nah, Hawkeye's not really good. He's a good. He's a good character. He's a good guy. He trained you. <laughs> trained your <laughs> king. <laughs> he help train character. your king. He is yes, a good he's, guy. He's, he's he a good guy. He tried to say he can kill him, bro. Kill who? He tried to say he's strong enough to fight him later on. He said, yeah, yeah, come uh, back, come back. Mihawk is a good guy. He's definitely a good guy. He was the only guy, once Whitebeard was actually done, he left. He completely, like, he wasn't trying to just chop man down. He's a good guy. He, 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 he's affiliated with Shanks, so he has to be No, he, 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 he was there. He was there till Shanks came, bro. What do you mean? Mihoop was there fighting until Shanks came, bro. He was still fighting White Bay Pirates after White Bay died. No, when Shanks came, that's when he left. That's what I'm saying. But before Shanks came, when after White Bay died, Mihoop was still on the battlefield. Yeah, because yeah, but Shanks came and said, "If anyone still wants to fight, you have to fight us." And the yeah, so man was like, "Yes, yeah, he he didn't leave because he was a good guy, bro. He left because he didn't want to fight Shanks." Well, yeah, yeah, I guess so. Yeah, yeah, yeah like he, he, don't make it sound like he left. Like, oh, yeah, he, he's he, still a good guy. He, man. he, 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 so he trains Zoro. What? So you're telling me Zoro was training with an evil guy? No. Look where he was training. He went training with a good guy. Zoro's not a good guy like that as well. Zoro's not a good guy. He's not not the goodest of guys. Mm. Like, I don't how good it's two shoes. Is a Disney goody two shoes baby? We what? Zola. Oh. Fam, what's going on, fam? I like Zolo. Where was we in the chapter? Fam, we haven't even got anywhere in the chapter. No, nah, but oh, this, yeah. this is good, what though. Like, this is what happens when you go panel by panel. Like You have more interesting discussions. I guess so. But it does take flipping long, though, can't lie. So, yeah, we were here. Someone was talking. Someone was saying... What was, it was about what was... the devil fruits and uh, the cloning of the fruits and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He was saying what? I think we even moved past that. Let's even let's proceed with the thing, innit? So shit. Yeah, so yeah, every man what do you man think of the devil fruit really? Yeah, that's what well, the dice dice fruit. So I at one point I was surprised because I thought that this guy is gone, fam. Uh, um, someone had to die in order for you to get the to the fruit, in order yeah, for you to yeah. get access to the fruit. But it turns out, it turns out it's not the case. So at one point, they must have had, they must have gotten the the lineage factor, um, or the what they call the bloodline element thing. They must mm. have gotten it during whilst they were in prison, obviously. So that seems like to be the the only way that makes sense. So that's, but the crazy thing now is, is like, so you have. You have this guy who flipping have King's fruit. I mean, King's abilities. You know what I mean? Because with King now, King King is a flipping, what's it called? He ain't got a devil fruit. That's literally how he is. That's his race, right? So King has a devil fruit. Huh? King has a devil fruit. No, sorry. King has a devil fruit. But I'm saying how they managed to get the lineage factor of King wouldn't be the same way they do with devil fruits. Um, do you get what yeah. I mean? And, and 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 the thing about King, I'm pretty sure they um because of when they were experimenting on him, they would have had his lineage factor before he ate that fruit. Before before he ate the fruit, exactly. Because he was young back then. Yeah. Arba. Yeah. Oh shit, I called him King. Arba, Arba. Why do you call him Arba? That's his name. Is that his first name? Yeah. That's why I call him Arba. That's his name. 
That's his, that's his, that's the name is his Lunarian mom gave man. What's Queen's name? Um, just to my knowledge, it's just Queen. Have you man been seen watching the anime? Yeah. Oh, we're not recording right now, right? We are. Oh shit. Oh shit. Okay, yeah. Let's try stick to the thing. You feel about that, man? Hey, what, what you been thinking? You're the only one that still watches that shit, man. Yeah, I watch it. Hey. Yeah, man. Hey, I mean, I, I haven't actually watched the latest episode, but the last episode I remember watching was the the Zoro Marco uh, Sanji Zolo. You know that whole gonna, that whole the last episode huh? that killed me. Man. That killed me. Yeah, yeah, fam. That shit was crazy. No, I'm just, like the the one with Zoro and Sanji. Then man, that was a good one. But the last one that came on Sunday, that was oh. What chapter was it based on? What, what? I don't know. Um, hold on. It was Sanji's kind of tweaking a little bit. Um, oh, you know. when he first started feeding the... Oh, oh, when, when Zoro was blocking him and then he was like, oh, I owe you nothing, blah, blah, blah. Okay. To be honest, yeah, I'm really looking forward to that Sanji fight with Queen when it gets animated. Sometimes That's with the anime, obviously how good one else be, sometimes the pacing kills it. Oh, my God. Isn't it very flawed uh, flipping arc fam but anyway do you guys think it's a bit redundant for the s hulk to have um the dice dice fruit i guess it's just extra isn't it? Uh, in a way yeah because it's just the same thing literally the same thing right like he can do uh, that with his yeah sword. but the potency of the attack would be different though no? Yeah, I was gonna say I feel like it does it to a, I feel like it does it to a different degree. I don't know what type of grade his current sword is, but let's just say it's a high grade sword. The potency of attack would be different because you, you know, it would just be different. Not, I mean I mean I don't see how. So if you were to give Zoro a different sword, um he's the potency of attacks would just be different, right? No? If you were to give him a fuddle sword. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Because he's only a bad man now because of Enma. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Ooh. And the dice dice fruit he's using part of his That's own body. Shade. That's a shade. Of course it's shade. I'm a Sanji fan. Man oh, said what? man said he's only like that because of thingy, fam. I think so. But, but hold on. That's those. true. Hold 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 You know what's mad, yeah? Just a quick side note, yeah. Just a yeah, quick side on. note. It's mad to me, yeah, how Zora's power up here yeah, wasn't really through no honing of his skills, yeah. The sword forced it out of him. I've and been no saying no a problem with that. I've been saying no one has a problem with that. I'm actually surprised. I have a problem with that. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. No, no, no. I actually have a problem with that. This is one of the flaws and one of the. I've had a problem with that for the longest. I've never had a problem with that. Listen, even in power scale, I was like. Of course they do now, John. No, no, I've always had a problem with I've had a problem with Sanji's power up. I had a problem with. Zoro's power up, it didn't make sense. Um, yeah, and I had a problem with Luffy's power up as well. You're a so, hater. I've had the power up <laughs> all three of them. Huh? You're a hater, though. No, but I have I actually have no, I'm saying, reason. It, don't 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 group me in with, with um don't group me in with Saints with, with Saints problems. It? My problems are different than it. I, I I had different problems. I don't think there's a, any problem with any of the power ups. Like, okay, I've had a problem. Do you know what? I've had a problem. Do you know what? I've had a problem. A lot of people only, who watch anime, um, they just want power ups to come from trading because that's what we're used to. That's what you're going to. Okay, he's earned it, but sometimes you have to switch up, man, because it's not always going to be like that. And realistically, Plus, they no, can't no, 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 I hear that. Boss, but that man is suit. No, 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 I hear that, but. At the same time, if you're telling me to accept that, what the writer or the person that's telling me to accept that also has to accept is that if you give me a power up that can easily be taken away, then I won't know how to judge the character in terms of power scaling. If you tell me that oh that's Zoro is this strong, it. but I'm saying if you if you, if you tell me that Zoro is this strong or he's literally five times stronger just because he has a sword, well 
um, we've seen many times in which Zoro has lo lost his swords in many arcs. So if you're telling me that we're now going to an Admiral Island or your Yonko Island or we're going to go fight the Gorosei, no, I don't want a, my second strongest person to only be the second strongest when he has his sword. Don't tell me that, oh, the character like Luffy. I understand oh, yeah. what you're saying, <laughs> that, I understand what you're saying but the thing is with something like that, he's only losing his sword if the right wants him to lose his sword. If he, the right doesn't want him to lose his sword, he's not. Yeah. Sword. No, no, I hear that, but then that's the possibility. Obviously, we don't know what but the writer wants. Well, it, 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 it's that's like, a possibility unless Alder wants it to be a possibility. Do you know what, what it's like? No, no, no. Do you know what it's like? It's like telling me, okay, there's gear third, but gear after gear third, he goes miniature, and then and, and, and nothing happens. So now you're telling me that we're going to the Gorosei to go fight the Gorosei, but Luffy can't use gear fifth. I'm, why Why are you giving him the power up? So don't tell me that, oh, Zoro is five times stronger now, but there's a possibility that at some point he could not have Enma. Because then it's like, well, okay, why are you just, why are you giving him the power up? Well, your, your, your problem also, is thinking, sorry, your sorry, problem can I just finish off? Like, yeah, yeah. also with the, with the sword thing, I, I, I get what you're saying, but I bet it's one of those ones where, let's say he was to lose the sword and was to pick up a photo sword. I'm not saying he'll be as strong, but I bet he would still be able to do similar things. I know. I, I, I agree. Sword, I, no, no. The sword has just brought him to it. No, no, I, I agree. No, no, I agree. I, I agree with that. In terms of from before when he picked up the sword to um, at this point now, yes, without Enmar, I would say he is quite a bit stronger than that point. My problem is that the, the power in which Enmar gives him is so drastic that no, at this point in time, I would be on the other side to say no. I don't think he reaches half of Enma um, of, en of the of the strength level he outputs with Enma without it. You, no, that's you know, the I, thing. I, your your I, problem is thinking. I, the reason why I say this, I don't think you know that white and, 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 and the sword Vista. I don't think Vista picks up the sword and he's able to wield it the same way Zoro people that wields it. What Enma? I don't think he can wield it. No. And, but that, that, but you you still just you're still talking to me about Enmar. I don't care about Enmar. I'm saying yes, I know. He's, yeah, because know he's, Zoro is at the right I, level to wield a sword like that. Because it's you to give the sword to someone else, they can't use it. But he was at the right level before he picked it up. Yeah, just the can't right use that shit. And but, it's, but I'm, I'm saying telling me telling me that Zoro is at the level to use Enmar doesn't tell me much because before he picked up Enmar, like the first time he picked up Enmar and Enmar tried to zap his arm, he corrected that real quick. So he was already at the at the stage in which like in which he could control Enmar to some degree. He's definitely gotten better and definitely gotten like stronger from it at that point. So I'm agreeing with that. I'm saying that you can't tell me that his power up being able to control Enmar is or you're telling me that well without Enmar he's half as strong as one slash when he's with Enmar. No, I don't think, think it's I, that I, deep I don't, he's I, half as strong. I'm I'm saying okay, for example, I don't think I don't think he's cutting cliffs without Enmar. I think you can do that now. I don't think he's cutting cliffs without Enmar. It's personally, personally. I, it, it, and I'm I'm just I'm I not think saying he could do that before. He could cut a cliff before. Then, then why was this? Then why was it such a big thing when he cut the cliff? I think it was because the output was just a lot. Whose background noise is that? That's what I'm thinking. This is munching on something. I feel like they're crunching on that. So. It's Zoro could always cut a cliff. A cliff isn't anything. You could probably do that like Fisherman Island. To be fair, it's fair, it's, it's just fair, that Enma has given him a lot more power, and it's a lot easier I'm, to get out of that power. Yeah, I'm just saying, I don't think, I don't think in terms of to the degree that Enma draws out his haki, I don't think that without Enma, Zoro can draw out 70% of that haki power. Yeah, eventually he'll be able to do it. Eventually, of course he will eventually. Eventually it saying, could be like five chapters. Oh, yeah, it could be. Or it you could know why be Zoro's wet? Yeah. <laughs> Zoro's wet because... That, it could be. Oh, my you know why Zoro's wet? Right now. Now. This guy should have taken his, um, you know, his relative. The Shimotsuki guy. Uh, a legend. He should have had, legend. he should have that guy's sword. I'm, I'm I think actually it's... out here with Odin's shit. Like that's wet, fam. Where's but that's Ulos King. Who has that sword? King. Who has that sword? You that see, my problem dead, my, my yeah. problem with Zoro and Wano is isn't isn't, isn't Enma. No, isn't not Shu Swing. You know the guy, John? You know the guy that was bagged with Yamato in the anime recently? Yeah. 
Yeah, the one that looks like Zora. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, the shroom. I don't oh, know. Is even, that, I think it's called Kozora that, or something. What, is, is he meant to be the relative to, what, to Zora? Oh, come on. He looks exactly like him. Hey, that's how I'm trying. Someone, someone's meant to be huh? his dad. I didn't even know. Uh, Zora is definitely a shroom. I've been watching one. Of, I know what tribe he is in terms of the one. And I don't know if you man have heard theory, theory, but you know the theory that you know the big giants, are, I forget what they're called, that uh, Kaido controls. The uh, numbers. The, yeah, numbers. The, yeah, the numbers are actually the free samurai. Yeah, I saw that theory. I saw that theory. Because they actually but, look alike. But you know if that's true, then do you know what that means? What, what? The normal the normal size sword that the man used to carry is somewhere out there and Zoro ain't got it. That's you, man's king. <laughs> My my problem with Zoro in Wano wasn't even the use of Enma because I could you could justify the use of Enma and you could justify it. there's many reasons why but my problem with Zoro was that he, in order for him to sort of realize become he had an arc but that arc didn't make sense because his arc was he was afraid of guy he was afraid of Enma sucking too much haki That's and right. if he did suck too much haki he was gonna die. Since when from chapter one has Zoro ever been scared? You're, no, you're oh, overblowing it, man. Like, I don't even like Zoro as much as some of you, man. You, man, nah, he wasn't, you, man, you man, he wasn't. No, 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 he knew it was a real possibility. When he, and said, he, went, he, 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 went, he, went, he said, if I have to go to hell or if I have to die, then I'll become the king of hell. He wasn't phased. Yeah. No. No, he, what, he, that he, was, he that was after, though. No, hold on. He just, he just knew known, my kid. Ever since we've known Zoro, he's never been afraid to die. That's one thing, right? He's never been afraid to die. And then you come to Wano, this guy, he's thinking, like, if I release too much of my hacky, I'm eventually going to die. That was the, that was his, basically his arc, to realise that, wait, Odin, oh, he's he's Odin, Odin was, oh, it was actually his art in order for him to conquer the sword. He had that, to come to that, that realization. That's not even a major plot point, really. Come on. Come on. No, that, I mean, was his, that was his art. That's worth, his, worth reading. Come on now. Worth come reading on into now. that too. That's much. not even a plot point. You're not, even, you're not understanding. You're not understanding. She that's not even a plot point. This, this guy said, yeah, this guy, Zoro, said that um, Odin, Odin was releasing his full hacky and he wasn't afraid to die. But. Anyway, that's it's just going too much into. Let's go back into this chapter, fam, because this is gonna. For real, man, I hate it on Zoro, but I'm here for you know, I, I just literally Fuck just tried to hate on him quickly, and then it led into that. Uh, nah, but let's just leave it. But you might not hate. Go back to this thing. I'm distracted, fam. What the hell? Nah, for me, uh, I'm. D- I, I I don't mind the Enma thing. For me, it should have just ended with he gives Enma back to Momo, and he just got stronger from using it, and then we carry on with a new sword. No, nah, man. Or just gradually getting stronger. Did he get that money. sword that Luffy had? That Luffy no, got he from. Um... Nah, 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 he, no, he didn't. Man, man. Nah, he yeah. dropped it. I that, was man, so that was yeah, a good man. That was a good man. Cool, Cap- 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 that's going to make me want to back him up more. You know what I mean? Captain said <laughs> Lada. <laughs> and then it's going to get. Captain said Lada. Isn't that sword that Luffy had? Isn't that um one of the swords that most of them lost in Kyuri? No, that was no, no, no. He, he, he. It nah. was a Kitetsu blade. It's, it's the trend that Zoro is. It's Zoro's main blades are Kitetsu. Yeah, it was, it was a, it was a, it was a, it was a crazy yeah. thing. I don't even know. But all these swords look the same. There's no real design. But I used to be a Zoro enthusiast. I used to know about uh, Yubashiri and all the man fucking shoes. <laughs> <Sweet. laughs> I don't know how to pronounce the thing. Love me. But yeah, man, I used to be a Zoro guy. But no, Zoro, Zoro fell off in it. But that's that's <laughs> guy. I think he fell off as well. I've, I've got, I've got. Oh, you got to hate to pick nah, up. Nah, he fell off. Still, I'm, I'm saying he's still better. Nah, he he fell off because like, the gap between him and, on, on and how how you right like now it's a bit, it's a bit too wide and it's getting on my nerves. So you know, the chapter, really the think. chapter. Yeah, back to so, the chapter. Yeah, well, so yeah, so what? Everyone spoke about the fruit. Yeah, the fruit's dry. When when you actually have time to settle, the fruit's actually dry. But it would have been overkill if that guy had a good fruit. Man, it would have been too much. Yeah, I suppose. But it's just, it's just like it's, it's, it's just funny because the fruit, the dice dice fruit, was the fruit that he, the the person that he fought a guy who used that fruit. 
Yeah, do you see how Zora was shocked? Did you see Zora's face? Yeah, 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 face. Like, oh my days, yeah. That was <laughs> <still. laughs> hey, that guy was rattled. Nah, he, he was like, dice dice yeah. kick, man. Yeah. 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 Yeah, young, man, young, man, young man does. They must end them. Flipping no, but back to the sheriff. Like this, these guys, yeah, these guys' durability are so mad. Yeah, yeah they're taking they're joint so attacks mad. from Yonkos and fucking. Do you know boy. what I mean? Like they've got, they've got the Arbor body, and that body is tough as fuck. Do you know what I mean? Amazing. And when, and, when yo. Yeah. It's crazy, fam. What, have they even reacted to any... Have they felt any pain yet? We don't know, fam. Don't we haven't, because... Nah, imagine, they, yeah, one they, of the Seraphim got they licked they by Yonko and Awaken Rob Lucci. They've done a joint attack. They, they, Zolo they, they, and Rob have done a joint we'll attack. We'll get there. We'll get there. The Seraphims were calm. This guy I, I don't Yonko. think. I don't, I don't think they feel pain, bro. We'll you know get there. thing we'll about get Luffy, there. yeah? You know, I expected Luffy to do one of them lightning AC OC bangs in base form. That's a that's my problem. Yeah, I thought problem. he was gonna lick them with nah, one of those. See, but he went into see. he went he he went into gear four. He went into you know he was still trying to use his arsenal, wasn't it? I guess he ain't trying to. But one thing about Luffy is yeah, and no one's been talking about this. Luffy yeah, after he used his powers against uh, Luchi and he was sitting with Zoro the other chapter, he was bare tired after. So, bro, that, right that's now, exactly that's what I was going to say. He's even in a position say. where he don't want to be using what? his maddest shit right now because he might nah, be see, shook. See, that. see, see, and we're trying that, to escape. That, that's what's it. That's that's what I was going to get onto earlier. But when Worth said, um, "Wait till we get uh, to this point," you see, at this point, yeah, when they've agreed, that's why I don't like the one problem I had here. Yeah, I don't like what Luffy said in the last part when he reassured. He um, tried to get reassured with Luchi after this conversation um, when they agree oh they'll go back in cuffs afterwards and he goes to Luchi um, to say oh um, you know you can't beat me but afterwards are you going to promise you won't get my friends that's exactly leading off what um, of what um, Prince just said because um, yeah with with that um, yeah with Luffy, with Luffy asking that question he's basically that's what I don't like he's basically admitting that yo I know I'm calm. I know you can't beat me. There's no one on this island that can kill me personally. But he knows because of what happened with um, what's uh, Sekamaru? Uh, no, Sentamaru. Yeah. Because of, what, because of what happened with Sentamaru, I think Luffy knows that because of the lack of control in Gear in Gear Five, he knows that he will be calm, but he cannot protect everybody around him. So he need that I don't like that he asks for that reassurance. He's basically admitting defeat, saying, "Well, I know that um, I know that I can kill you, or I can control you, or I can put you back in these cuffs. But if I allow you, I know that if you go for Nami, if you go for um, Sanji, if you go for Chopper, or whatever, whoa, 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 whoa. Can't, can't, he, he can't really get to you in time, kind of thing. Do you think Sanji needs? protection from Lucci. That's exactly what I was thinking. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm you know what example. the maddest thing is? Yeah? I, I'll just use an example. I, feel like if you I, would, say, I would say, I would say <laughs> you're you reading too much into it. Yeah. I would say you're reading too much into it because it doesn't even take yeah, Zoro or Luffy to protect the Straw Hats. If Kaku and um, if Kaku or Lucci tried it yeah, and Sanji was there, with Brooke, with Frankie, with no, Bruce, with Robin, no, 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 it's not. They're not doing nothing. They're not doing nothing. Like the straw hats are actually like, comfy. Like, like uh, but, 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 and, but really, yeah. Uh, Sanji and Brooke are not able to together. protect them. Sanji and Brooke, them two, would just protect the thing. Like nothing's happening. I don't, fam, I don't know, man. Like, if Kaku and so, Lucci gets Kaku the way, the way Lucci are strong, but they're not that strong. It's not that deep. In it. F- um, yeah, every the, chapter their portrayals going down. So Oda made them look mad when they first came back, but since then he's been sh- he's been shitting on them slowly. But it's, it's nah, not. But, it's, it, nah, it seems like it's a thing that has to be done. He's trying to show us something that these nah, guys but, are not guys anymore. 
but we can't we can't take it for granted, man. The way the way Lucci busts and tomorrow, it wasn't even on a skill thing or it was just on a dirty thing. So it's he not even tomorrow. a thing of like, oh, what? what? He said tomorrow, man. <laughs> I, no, no, no. I'm, I'm not saying it in terms of strength. That's, that's what I'm saying. Don't miss that. I'm not saying it in terms of strength level. I'm saying it in terms of a dirty level. I'm saying it's not like, oh, Lucci's going to wait till he busts his Frankie, Brook, Sanji and all that before he now goes for Chopper and Usopp. It's like a thing of, fam, zoom, soru. The way I see it is, Usopp yeah. in his chest. The way Usopp. I see it is, Lucci, it's not, it's not a, Lucci not a, will not fuck a, Lu Lucci up so differently, yeah. That Luffy is banking on him knowing this and not trying any funny shit. I don't no, think that's why it is. Because Luffy said to him, that, "You can't fuck with me point. anyway. You can't beat me." No, that's my point. If if so, he if, knows not to touch if, his friends. No, no, no. I'm saying that if if you're saying that, if what you're saying is true, Luffy wouldn't need to say the, say what he said. That's my point. I don't like the, the history. Like, they have a history, you, man. These two no, is but, different. He has to he has to let him know. But, Do you but know how big it is all, for Luffy all, all, all to say that all... to Lucci? Did you see that man's fight? That was nah, Luffy's nah. hardest fight ever. And now mm, he's what? telling the guy, you Debatable. can't beat me. This is big. John, scroll down. Nah, that's actually, yeah. Nah, but that's that, a I'm massive, saying, that's a massive. Flex, it's huge. You know? I, I, I hear that. You might not, you're, I'm saying what he said after that. That's the problem I have. I hear that he's gloating. Yes, you can't f with me. But the point that he's making out, or he has to stipulate that you have to promise that you're not gonna go after my friends. He's stipulating that because he knows that. Well, you can't f with me, but me in Gear Five State, I cannot protect everybody. That's that's what I don't like. That's that shit I don't like. I mean. I'm saying, if, if you if, if if he was that confident of saying, "Yo, listen, you can't f with me," and everybody else is calm, all he would need to say is, "Fam, listen." For after, me, after after, after, you're my, you're my best after what Lucy cuffs, said, yeah, I don't even see Lucci and Kaku as a threat anymore. They're just not even a threat now to I, me. That, that's yeah. almost on the same level as Flex when Green Bull came and uh, you had the scum uh, fight in Green Bull, and then you had Zoro. Yeah, I don't really see him as a threat. Luffy standing and just watching over them. That's almost as yeah. big as that flick. That was so cold. Oh, yeah, I mean, they, when they were sitting outside the points, little Japanese thing. Yeah. Oh, Both of your they, points make sense. Both of your points. <laughs> then I said, should we go? Yeah, yeah. I swear someone said that. that it was, um, I think it was Zoro. Zoro was like, well, should we go? Oh, we go? my day. You know, right now, yeah, the crew, yeah, when we're, we're, like, it's, it's, it's the Straw Hats that's looking like the red hair pirate, like, yeah. like, when the panels come, yeah, if you, actually, this is, the crew star-studded, fam. That's, that's actually crazy. under, that's an under- <laughs> No, 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 change, Having change, that change. quartet, yeah, no, no, stop, stop, having, stop, stop. having Luffy, Jinbei, Sanji, Zoro, whose crew is better than that? Oh, well, the left who's got four better than that? No, no bro, Shanks, what do you mean? Oh, I mean, they're, they're, that's 11. But the rest what? of them, I mean, that's a level. Them are weak, say, though. Yeah, I remember I would that. Say, yeah, I would say, yeah, with the red hair pirates, yeah, in terms of waviest crews, they, they're the benchmark. So if the shorts are getting compared to them and it's only them that's wavier, I would say cool, but that's cool for now because we know only... Zoro's going to surpass Beckman and we know Luffy's going to surpass Shank. But if they aren't already, but yeah. If they have, if Zoro hasn't already, I know, nah, Luffy, hasn't, yeah. I know Luffy hasn't yet. But Zoro no, might Zora, be stronger Zora. than Beckman. No, no, stop it, stop it. Oh, yeah, Think this about it. Funny. He might not have ACOC. This, this is what. I, this, this, is what this is what. This is what. This is what I don't. This is what I don't like, man. Nigga just speculating, not telling me. Ben this is Zoro. 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 Because he's because he's not like This is what I don't like. We'll get there, innit? We'll talk about if Zoro is stronger than Beckman. I'll not be surprised. I'm saying, yeah. I'll be I'll be disappointed. I'm saying when we get to the when we get to the panels. I'm saying when we get when we get to the panels. We'll see it in it, but um, Shanks' but, crew is a different kind of crew in it. This is not. This, this, these are not. These, these are not pirates in it. These, these, these are these are governors in it. It's different. It's different. <laughs> it's different. <laughs> it's different. <laughs> That's a lot of pirates. It's very, very from different. Frankie, in there, listen, from Frankie all the way up to Lucy, no crew can stand up to them guys here. But from Frankie, stop it, man. What are you talking about? That's straight from facts. Below? From below, oh from below, yo, these lot don't even have armament hacky, they have observation hacky. Like, they are 
proper week. Like, I, I, you week. can't even. Yeah, from, but. From but, but, but from yeah, but they're from still, they're from still growing. They're still growing. They're still What's growing. Yeah, observation, man, say, in, terms, in terms of a Yonko crew, you still have weak members. Like, weak, weak members. You know what I mean? The thing I'm is about the straw hats compared my to everyone down. else is that the straw hats don't sure. have numbers. In terms of Yonko, I'm not talking about numbers. I'm saying, I'm just saying, in terms of when you compare the, the haven't short, been the a Yonko crew for two months yet, though. Allow them. Like, when they're gonna grow in into two it. days? Probably, okay. probably. Okay, okay. And you see Nami's power up. You see yeah, Nami, but but, but more. She's not physically. Okay, I, 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 I need her. To, let's all yeah, she I want, never I want her to have hacky, to but I want her to have hacky. Like this is your you young the character. No, I can't lie. I, think, I need her I to have hacky. I think it's unbecoming of Nami to have black fist and be clashing man and banging. I think it's important. Like, no, I think she needs a level. Of, she needs she's a level of that. No, but I think all this kind of do to be the parroting through. You need. I think what all this trying to do. I think what all this trying to do is that he's trying to show that. Not everyone needs Haki because they are Nami and Nami and basically be like hold on, hold on. they're Yonko crew, but only about what four of them actually have Haki. The rest of them don't, but they're still Yonko crew. There are no more than four of them have Haki, bro. But which which it's a bit like it's a bit weird for me. It's not have Haki. Why do you think? Why do you think? Why do you think Oda didn't let them fight in the in one off? Because they weren't strong enough. Like they need to get fight in one off. No, but look, look, okay. Who did Nami fight? Nami fought. Who did Nami yeah, fight? Yeah, the guys that were and Page One. Ulti, Ulti man. and Page Ulti. One. Ulti. They, they Ulti were about to get fucked up by Ulti and Age One until Big Mom helped them. Ulti got, yeah. Ulti got dust. Yeah. Yeah. Got, yeah. got, no, she, she didn't, though. She yeah, got helped by Big Mom. They're ended. recruited because of their strength. Ended. Of course they're stronger than Nami. What do you want yeah, that to that's do? What I'm saying. That's what I'm talking about. A Yonko's crew, right? A Pirate King's crew. You can't have someone like Nami that weak. Oh, they are Yonko. You need a wow. Big... That's what I'm saying. It's not making sense to me much. You know what I mean? I'm saying it's not making sense to me that Shaki, Yusuf, Nami and Group are that weak. Hold Shaki on. Why not? Just Why those not? Three characters. Because Just those three characters. Because she's too nice. It's not making sense to me. When you compare you when you compare Kaido's crew, the, the weak members, or the Toby Rofos, look at them, fam. Yeah, but they only recruit people based on strength. No, but if you don't do that, this is the Pirate King's crew. This is the Pirate King's crew. They have to be. They have to be level. They have to be level. Okay, but guess what? Who's badding up Nami? Toby Ropers up. The the weakest Toby Ropers is badding up Nami. Yeah, but yeah, but the weakest member is Shanks. Nami end of series is not going to be Toby Ropo level. End of series, be. Nami is not gonna. She better be because you think end Black of Bay. series, Nami is gonna be able to deal with someone like who's who? I, no, the Black Bear parrots who, who all have devil fruits and they all probably all have hacky. Yamato is fighting Katarina, Katarina Devon. Even oh, who, she's too strong Nami for Robin to fight them. Who's Nami going to fight? Them? I don't think Nami. You know the thing anyone. is about the Straw Hats and their all strength right. is that the Straw Hats are different. They're meant to be different from other crews. The old will find a way to have them still win without hacking. That's they what you're doing. Hacky, fam. It's their they special. <laughs> That's what they're doing. That's what you're doing. They need to have hacky, fam. Okay, you're no. saying that, but the Yonko crew right now, but they don't have hacky. So what's your problem? We still make much. They, they can be, but they're not Yonko because of them. Oh, it's only, only three because people, Because of man. the top four. Yeah, it's because of the three people. You know what I mean? Yeah, That's and, the only reason and... why they're Yonko. And it's embarrassing. It's not embarrassing. <laughs> oh, you won't say is. that's the only reason. Nami is the most important. Obviously, navigate our blah blah blah. They play an important role. But this is a pirate manga. Yeah, where where strength where strength matters, and you're meant to be a yonko. If you're a yonko crew, it's based on strength. It's based on heart. It's, right, it's based on power. The thing is, yeah, I understand so, you're so, using so, Nami, wait, so, but Robin was able to defeat a top of Ropo. She didn't use Haki. Trouble yeah, which, which, is which is embarrassing. Which is embarrassing on Kaido's crew. Kaido's crew, they all have hacky, but for some reason we didn't see them use it. That's they're what all I'm powerful, but for some reason, for some reason, they didn't seem like, like they that. went all out. All That's all what I'm I can't, I can't lie. Yeah. Robin should have been using hacky. Yeah, uh, ages ago. Is bad. That's why the the fight is not. You know, it's not. Surfing don't use hacky, do they? What? The surfing don't use hacky, do they? We don't know no, yet, no, not at the moment. Not so hold far. on. So the seraphim are that strong, but you're still trying to shout at Nami and them, and but not needs to use Haki. Yeah, but, but they have got lunarian bodies. So they, they have, they have lunarian bodies. They have lunarian body, and they have. Yeah, 
and, it, and it's they, very different, John. Very different. Wait, so wait, so, wait, so they're always going to make it that they don't even need Hakimi. Hey, hey, Saint. So, so where do you think Nami should be uh, be at right now in terms of power scaling? Like, where do you think she should be for right me, now? For me, the way I saw the the way everything when we when, when we started the new world, everything was leading up to big to Big Mom and Kaido, and Nami, Usopp, Sanji, Zoro, Frankie. Um, thingy. They all didn't get major fights, and I under, I'm starting to understand why now they didn't get any major fights because Oda was waiting for the, that that one or arc in order to give them all power ups and all of that stuff. I, I'm starting to get it now, and I'm and I'm at peace with the fact that not all of them, not Sanji and all of them, didn't pro- get a proper fight, and I'm at peace with it now because I realize that okay, the one or arc is coming. That's the biggest arc, yeah, and then Oda is going to show everything there, and then we get there. And, it, and I was less disappointed. We didn't see nothing from Nami apart from that shit power up. Yeah. Oh, shit power and then we didn't see nothing. That's my mm-hmm. opinion. We didn't see we didn't see anything from Yusuf. This is the Good. biggest saga after the new world. The Good. biggest saga after the new world. I expected no, all of them. I was them. disappointed with Usopp. I was disappointed. I, was disappointed. I, was, disappointed. I, was, I expected all of them to fight to fight strong characters. I expected I think I, I think Nami like, had a fight. good showcase though. Yeah, Nami's yeah. showcase I mean, was okay. It was I like I like my Nami. expectation. My expectation was I want I wanted that classic fight. I want that classic show. You ain't getting them classics get. anymore, bro. Oh, damn, I don't. Man. Yeah, I, I, yeah. I wanted that classic fight, that classic fight that we used to get, and and I and I was expecting it in one or because we went so many arcs not seeing them properly, and then we get to one or and we don't even see it. So that was disappointing to me. I feel Group, like in, I feel like get a, get that classic fight, Frankie. Didn't get that classic fight. Uh, no, sorry, Frankie did, but Brooke and Sanj and Thing, Brooke and Nami and uh, Flipper. All right, and can I ask a question? I wanted all of them, and I needed all of them to get that fight. Do you think everyone? I think the last ends. time that's gonna happen is gonna be versus the Blackbeard Pirates, and then. Nah, that, yeah, but it better, it better make sense. Worth. If if Nami fights and if Brooke fights and if and if and if you so, it, it there'll be sense. another arc. There'll be, I think, one more arc where that's you get saying, your pre-time man. skip. Fight. They would, they would get fix. some huge power up. They'll get some huge random power up. Like, where do you that think from? <laughs> all of the Blackbeard pirates have hacky? I hope so. Because I because I I'm so. because I'm going to place a bet and tell you not everyone is even going to showcase hacky. I'm telling you. Oh no! They it, 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 they they won't, won't know that they, they, they will definitely have it. They will definitely have it. Not all of them are going to showcase Haki. I, I'm are telling you. Say, are you saying? Are you saying not all of them have Haki, or all of them are not going to show Haki? It could be because both. It's a difference. That's where I disagree. They'll all have it, but they won't all show it for sure. You know, exactly. Oda ain't you know, gonna so... give us a linear black. And, and every the reason why I now. think this is because I think just for some characters, he's just gonna. Do you know what? I'm gonna have these actually, guys, actually, actually. Hold on, I'm gonna have these hacky. guys overcome. Because you're just saying hacky in general, it could be one of the three. Hacky. He's just, he's what? just gonna uh, do it like that. What? All I'm saying is that he's gonna make it so that some of the straw hats are gonna be able, be able to overcome some of the blackbeard pirates without hacky. He's just gonna do it like that. Like we know that he's yeah. just gonna do it like that. Kind of disappoint me already. You know what I mean? I'm yeah, not, not saying because think, what I, I want, think, or what, I'm just saying what he's not, gonna do. You I'm know that for, Nami's not gonna need Haki. I'm not gonna itching, for Nami, I'm not itching for Nami and um, and Chopper to show Haki. Really, maybe why not? Anyone, it's only why it's not? only Usopp that I want. I why don't actually, not? I don't even think Nami's not that type of fighter. What do you want Nami but to what, be doing? Black no, but my point is, people. no, she can have observation hacky. She needs to show that observation hacky is not even consistent in the series anyway. I think, I, think though, I just need to know that she has it and she's using it while she's fighting. Because I think on, she, though. I think she will develop it eventually. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I want her to develop it eventually. If if she develops it, as for Chopper, of, yeah, Chopper don't need Chopper it. Chopper should have hacky. If Look, Chopper, if Chopper should be using Blackfist from That's Chopper should, should have been using Blackfist from Fishman Island. Because when he, he came back, he should have had it in one of one of was when he part. had that kung fu shit, he was a Tony Tony. Tony Tony Chopper fan. He was whooping the yeah, Let's get back, let's get back to the panels. Like, should we go? Should we scroll down? So yeah, John, I was gonna tell you. So the seven Vega Punks, it's not that we're missing a seventh one. The seventh, there's already six, and the seventh one is the main body. The real I already, but that's what I said before. I said, 
that if you want to yeah. include the main Vega Punk, that's fine. If you don't, then there's still an extra one that's missing. Yeah, but you have to because Lucci is saying here eliminating all seven Vega Punk. So you then you have to include the main body. Okay, what's the main body's Punk. name? Um, it's Vega Punk, isn't it? Stella. Stella. Oh, what I is it? Was... Because all of the other um, satellites have like or have like a, have a name, like a yeah, yeah, yeah. So what I, is the main Vega Punk's name then? Because he would have a name, though. Maybe a genius. I don't know. Because we have good, we have evil, thinking, wisdom, violence, and greed. What's the main Vega Punk? Mm, that's true. If you can't think of that, then he's probably not included in the six. He might be. We just don't have a. We just don't have the name for it. You know what I mean? Wait, say, wait, say, say the names again. We got greed. So we have good. We have evil. We have thinking, wisdom, violence, and greed. Hmm. There should be two more. There's not meant to be two more, it's one. It wouldn't make any sense because each one you named is of the six. It's it's not it's not really the seven sins. It's I, I seven didn't say it was the six. I said, oh, I said the the names seven. I said they're meant to be based off that. I know. I didn't say they're gonna have the same names. It's obviously the but I, I'm names. no, but I'm saying it doesn't it doesn't sound like it's based off that because it sounds like the names you said called out, it sounds like they're in pairs. Good and evil, thinking and wisdom is pairs. And what's the last two? Violence and greed. You 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 were onto something until violence and greed. I understand what you were trying to say. I think that it it kind of makes sense, but no, quantum has gone. Should we scroll down? There's nothing much to say on this panel here. So, um, I was saying, yeah, so what's the last two again? Violence and greed. Yeah, violence and greed, uh, good and evil, thinking and wisdom. They're all pairs. Violence and greed all... are a pair. It is. Vi violence and greed go hand in hand. Thinking and wisdom go hand in hand. Good and evil go hand in hand. you got a little point there, yeah. Because if if it was the seven sins, that those aren't sins. Thinking and wisdom aren't. It's not, I, not, I didn't not say that. Yeah, he didn't say that. I said that based off the sins. That's what I'm saying. I'm saying even even being loosely based off it. I'm not saying you said the exact names. Even being loosely based off it, the titles for all six have no relation to deadly sins. Is what I'm saying. They they, they have a little loose. Three times of relation. Yeah, in terms of greed and thinking, maybe. But if it was, if, if it was good evil, those have nothing. That has nothing to do with the seven deadly sins. It, it technically, in terms of, it's a sin, so it's evil. But one being called good, another one being called. I hear evil. what you're saying. You're, yeah, that's so a that's a good way of looking at it. But you could also say that good and evil it comes in pairs, but they're opposites. And but thinking and evil, but thinking and wisdom aren't necessarily opposites. Yeah, it is because if you're thinking about something. It could be that you're trying to gain not you're trying to gain knowledge. You're trying to process something through your brain. If you have wisdom already, it means you have pre-existing knowledge. It could literally be two ends of a spectrum. You're thinking to gain knowledge, or you're so old and you uh, have. But wisdom. they're not opposite. They're just they're not opposites. They're not opposite though. But they don't have that to be. They don't have to be. I'm saying I'm not. I'm not saying the opposite. They're I'm pairs. saying both. I'm saying they're pairs. They go hand in hand. Either being okay. opposite. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good yeah. and evil. The same. I can even take thinking and wisdom. What about violence and greed? Violence and greed goes hand in hand. How is the same? It could be the same thing. It could be opposites, or it could just go like thinking and wisdom. It could be opposites like good and evil, or it could be thinking like um go hand in hand like thinking and wisdom. Either way. I see that they both go together. I, 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 I see the pattern, but you have to explain to me violence and greed. So for me, my the reason I would say they're pairs or my pairs theory, I will solidify it by saying I think Vegapunk does have a name and the person who's causing the problems, which is the seventh clone, would be the other pair. So it could be his alternate ego. So his bad self, basically. It could the be ego, self, the self. name, yeah. Yeah. Exactly. I hear you, I hear you. It could go hand in hand. So, Vegapunk's ego, which was built into 
a seraphim that was thrown away before discarded built itself back up whatever oh, oh, and then what you're trying to say but that you're still you're not really going against what i'm trying to say it's it's still another person that you're still expecting based on what you're saying yeah no I'm, I'm agreeing with it but i said two i said it should be a pair as opposed to being just one but then if it was two and then it, vega punk would be one of them that's what I'm saying. I'm saying as opposed to because in earlier in your theory you said maybe Vegapunk doesn't have a name and it's or Vegapunk isn't included and it's just one extra. I'm saying I think it's one extra, but Vegapunk is still included in the whole count. I think it's eight as opposed to seven. Because I'm, mm. I'm, I'm not going I'm not going to be that print. Included. I'm, I'm, How's Vegapunk yeah. included if he's in the prison cell right now? Yeah, ego. Whoever's, I'm, I'm just saying ego now. Just a thought. Said, that, you know, Vega that, Punk that, said, that, I can't believe this was happening under my nose. Hmm. Yeah, but it's, he's included. It still stands. Yeah, yeah, he's saying that there could be an eighth satellite, which is Vega eight Punk's eight. ego. Yeah, yeah seven eight satellite, eight, eight, but eight of them all together. Yeah, I'm saying Vega Punk is included oh, in the pair. I think the last, the last satellite we see will be the most polar opposite to Vega Punk. Not, it doesn't have to be a polar opposite, but if you go I, I if you're going with polar opposite, then fine. Based off what you want. yeah yeah no it it, 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 it it doesn't have to be a polar opposite. I just think it's kind of polar, polar opposite. I, I, the I, opposite I, of Vegapunk is, is is a dumbass. <laughs> no, 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 not 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 opposite. Not opposite. Not opposite. Literally, I mean polar opposite. <laughs> Maybe like in personality. Yeah, like personality motives and like. Let's say um, we can boil Vega Punk. So essentially, they just work in pairs. So whether it's yeah. polar opposite or it's just something that's similar to him, and then it will just be something grouped together with Vega Punk. So I think um, I think Sings one is actually on point. I think I think it's going to be Vega Punk's ego, in which he either assimilated into a clone at one point because obviously he has his gluttony for his stomach when he's eating he has his information he has pythagoras for um, writing down and creating his theories or whatever he has different people for different tasks so i think maybe his actual ego which not someone can't just cut away that part of themselves i think that's what he's constructing with kuma and all that i think you can't just seclude one part of yourself and just take only the best parts so I his bad part or the bad parts of his personality, like his his say ego, so his being him being so smart, him say his world domination or something like that, his plans or brain or the, the, basically the aspect of his brain for that that, that that triggers those thoughts. I think that's in a different clone. Okay, I hear that still. Um, uh, yeah. Have you lot clocked? We might, we probably have a, a quirk for Lucci now. You lot not, can you lot not see the funny as aspect of him? Yeah, what, he, uh, him trying honest. to be, him being honest? Yeah, him being honest. Too you lot not think it was slightly funny? Like, yeah. I, like it was slightly yeah, it was funny, it was funny. No, it was funny, it was funny. But it, it was funny, but I, I, I took it as him being fearless. I saw it as funny thing. Yeah, I, I, it, it was funny. I just took it as funny. He don't care, like whether you're gonna he, kill me or not. I'm gonna say how it is. Being, he's just being, he's just being honest. I like that. <laughs> no, that is that's 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 his programming as well, though. At the same time, <laughs> yeah, you're not even wrong there. Yeah, uh, Program, thing is huh? ending in ten minutes. So, anyway, can you scroll down, uh, John? Man like Luigi. I, I like his beard though. <laughs> the whole government thing. Nah, nah, just Luigi's um Luigi's beard. See the way he's done the design. He looks oh, cool. um, but yeah, it kinda yeah. looks like the whole government sign, isn't it? Mm. Oh yeah, it does though a little bit, yeah. Mm. I'm trying to grow that thing still. <laughs> <laughs> Are you still saying that twenty eight? He he was that John. Was it not you? I was just baiting, man. Yo, John, I mean, I was doing. I was... John, remember Chris. my black beard beard? <laughs> <laughs> what? Yeah, I, was, no, I was trying to grow a black beard beard. Oh, the neck beard. Teach. <laughs> I said, yeah. beard. Nah, he's he, fam, he's, yeah, I was trying to grow his beard. Fam. 
Like coming out like in flipping, that's crazy. Um, we've gone past Seraphim. We need to eat. we need to get to this 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 shank shit. Because yeah, really, who best. cares about all this we, we, we minutes talking about? Let's go to Dorian Brody. It's important the thing that I want to mention about these things. Go on. Like, you know what I mean? Um yeah, just keep keep go go down a little bit. And this is what you know we're arguing about, isn't it? What's that? That's what you lot, uh, Quams and you, French, were arguing, arguing about. Well, actually, oh, you know, oh, Luffy's and... words. I mean, yeah. come on. Yeah. That was good shit. Yeah, that's yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Right. yeah. I, 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 that I, didn't, I didn't like that, man. I didn't like that. You realise you can't beat me, yo. That would dumb flip, man. <laughs> yeah, from Luffy as well. You know, he's a humble guy. Like, I was surprised that. Nah, he's flexing. Yeah, that just shows real. you how much he's grown, isn't it? Like, yeah. Press that is like. I, actually, I'm not. I'm not surprised that Luffy's saying something like this. You know what I mean? Like, he's always been that guy to say things like this, even when he was an underdog. Yeah, yeah, hundred percent. You know what I mean? Because I remember he was talking crud to Crocodile. Oh, mm, yeah, you're talking a bit of smack, I don't gonna lie. Yeah. Crocodile's a dickhead, though. I'm waiting for that therapy. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, keep going down, keep going down. And did you say the meeting's ended? I can't see it. Seven minutes. Yeah. All right. Thank you. Oh shit! Well, what what did you want to say about the ser- What else did you want to say about seraphim? No, nah, been... I was just I was just gonna no, nah, I wasn't gonna I was gonna say about the seraphim, but I was I wanted to talk about like I felt like the CPO and the Shore Hats joining forces. I feel like it it feels a bit forced to me, and I say that because I feel like Zoro and Luffy. If they bust out Conqueror Attacky, their advanced Conqueror Attacky, they would immediately take care of those two. You know what I mean? Yeah. So if your friend, we just, just the previous panel, we heard Nami, Nami screaming. Now, if you really cared, I know obviously he cares about his crew, right? But if you, if when you think about it logically, like you've heard that you're, you've heard you, one of your crew members is um, screaming. So what are you going to do? I didn't think that he needed to. I understand why. Um, I understand why they wanted to free them because obviously they didn't want them to die, and it would it would it would leave a bad taste in their mouth. Fair enough. But you could easily end the fight. These two can easily end the fight, like literally in one shot using advanced conquer attacks. But then they end up not doing that. They're just using normal attacks. You feel me? Like it makes me feel like it's at the same it's time. Obviously, cool. this is Oda trying to showcase and hype up this new this this new thing in the story that has you know ousted the Shibukai. So the what the time he's trying to hype up the Seraphim, isn't it, Oda? Yeah, but so so, so the time the, the time for the Seraphim to get licked down, yeah, with 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 Haki and shit, yeah, with ACOC is gonna mm. be. Like further down the line, and to be honest, it might even nah, be obviously. someone like Shanks to do it first, but it's not going to happen in Egghead. But that's what I'm saying, though. It's it's that's fair enough. Like I get that, but then it makes it forced. It makes them two joining forces. <laughs> no, I would say forced. I would say they had to join forces because even as, as the Aye. Seraphim are too the Seraphim are too strong, yeah, for Luffy and Zoro to fend them off whilst protecting are two you, man this guy, the, if this guy was kind forget about trying to help um Luchi and Fingy. if this guy was Same kind fam, of, did you see the weight behind the seraphim when it clashed blackbeard when he clashed you see not. the weight on the attack from s you guys want to join the, the seraphim the are problem you, hmm? you can't just yeah, scrap the seraphim yeah, 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 whilst looking after a handcuffed it. person no, what i'm saying is, then I'm what general. i'm saying is if this was Kaido, he would have used his advanced concrete attack straight away Boys. and and hey, 
You know what I mean? To be honest, yeah, you know, with ACOC, yeah, I do think there's a warming up phase. Like, you kind of nah, have to be. Nah, now you're just I trying to like... justify. Just trying to you justify. Know do you know why I say that? You're cruising danger. You're cruising danger. Think why don't you know, you're a young cop? You know, you, know, you, just you, said, you just said Kaido would have done this, yeah? Kaido only used it once he was warmed up. All Kaido was doing was using his club. Join the new one. Just normal. All right, cool, 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 cool. That shit when he warmed up. When you warmed up, nah, he's making that. Nah, come on, it, it's 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 not. It's made up. These guys are yammering. I told him to join the new one. They were listening. Oh, sir. I could not one shot. Yo, oh. a Yonko Luffy. Advanced bro, we don't coated attack won't work on you. Are you're you saying, you're, you're saying, you're saying, no, see, you're saying it from what we know as readers. I'm saying it from the standpoint of them in the situation when let's say they, they've just bought the seraphim. So when you're there, no, they're not Luffy's not thinking I'm a Yonko, everybody's gonna feel my attack for some things. When he sees a certain level of strength, he'll be like, Well, when he sees Kuma's fruit being you. There's certain defenses like repel the repel fruit that can just repel no matter what I throw at man. So I, I have repel to repel fruit. Yeah, you know, you know, you know, no it's not. No, but you know, a, 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 a strength, a, an attack strong enough would be able to. Would be able to. No. you won't be able to repel. No, a, a no, that, that's the that's the. Bro, it's already been said when they when Kuma came out in the story, bro. No, yeah, so no matter say that. Obviously, he's going to say, "Are you telling me if are you telling me if Blackbeard, I'm sorry, if if Whitebeard or Kaido hit him with advanced conqueror's happy call and punch, mm -hmm. he's going to repel that? He'll break his arm." Bro, I'm saying that. I'm saying if Blackbeard hit him with an advanced conqueror's happy punch, S Hope will slash that. Yes, th these niggas have to be careful. It's not that just because they're young that, 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 that they're the strongest in the, in like above anything. Yeah, they were winning a fight. I'm saying they will, he would win in a fight. Luffy would not not scared. He will lose. But I'm yeah. just saying that the way he's throwing his punches, this certain strength level of a seraphim, he has to be. He has to be watching himself. He has to be careful. If, nah, that's if that, not, here, here's example, the dilemma, though. For, for example, for example, now, Joe, I'll ask you one question, and you can say your point. For example, why do you think Luffy didn't go Gear Five right now? I don't know. He went Gear Five against Luchi. Why I'm saying. I'm, I'm saying exactly. I'm saying right now in this in this in this technical situation when Gear Five has already cost Sentamaru getting stabbed in the stomach by Luchi, at this point in time when they have to um, protect one person each, why do you think Luffy didn't go Gear Five and just end both? Let me make a that, guess. That's what I'm saying. The Look at Let me the just dilemma. Make a guess. Let me make a guess. Yeah, something. John. 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 Try to answer. I'm just guessing he's trying to be a bit more serious about the situation right now. Yes, he he's a bit more delicate. He knows that. Oh, listen, he's trying to be a bit he, more. Serious. Yes, he, he knows that. Listen, if I go gear five, I yeah. do. I not fully control he's the situation. Fucking around. Too much. Not, yeah, yeah, it's too it's too much play. He can, he um, Luffy can at, at this point in time. At this point in time, Luffy cannot see three seraphims go gear five dead all three seraphims and ensure everybody else's safety behind There's him. two seraphims. He There's two seraphims right there. I'm saying, okay, two. Even two. Okay, two. Two seraphims. Luffy can't dead them both and ensure everybody's it's safety not Luffy, right now. It's not just Luffy that's there. It's Luffy and Zoro. They both have advanced conquerors. Like, look at the dilemma. There's two dilemmas here. Right? I'm saying, bro, I'm saying I'm, I'm saying both. Even so, even in the sense of... Oh, go on, go on, go on. There's two dilemmas here, yeah? They have enemies who are in handcuffs in handcuffs and one of them wanting to basically kill one of them wanting to kill his nakama right so they have every mm -hmm. reason not to trust them number one mm -hmm. number two he just heard his nakama screaming so now there's, there's tension here and there's pressure yeah. on him to act now mm -hmm. now that you have those two dilemmas you don't want to free your enemy number one your mm -hmm. nakama she's screaming out for help what are yeah. you supposed to do? Number three, you're a Yonko level um, character. You're strong enough not to one shot niggas, yeah? Why would you go on your gear fourth and use a normal attack when you can go gear fourth, caught it with 
conquerors hacky or go gear fifth, not even gear fifth. But if you don't want to go gear four, go gear fifth, call it with conquerors hacky. You and Zoro can do the same thing, eliminate them two. You've solved the so case. You know why you he won't, won't do that, Worf? You don't need to. You don't need to. Worf, you know why he won't do that? I get what you're going to say. Go on, say it. <laughs> the reason why he won't do that, like, I know because you don't, I know you don't like it when I bring up. He wants them to work together, which feels forced. I know you don't like it when I bring up other series, but when has a character ever just used his best and strongest move, and his best transformation just to finish that's something that they nah, never nah, do? Nah, that. That's, that, that, nah, nah, John, that's that's not a point. You can't you can't use that like other anime. I know, like, I know, but they just the don't do that. It. That like, it just doesn't happen. That's you fair can... enough, but I, I'm saying oh, the, 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 I'm saying it's, it's the same logic. thing. Let me use an, another example. It's, it's like no it's like at this. Fishman Island, Luffy could have used Gear Four from the very beginning. He just never done it. It just it just doesn't that's happen. Right. Yeah, and, and that's it's annoying. I'm saying it's that. annoying, but it just doesn't happen. But I'm I'm saying there's a logical reason in as to those why those actions or why that gear was used. Because oh, yeah, the, the, yeah, I'm saying, yeah. I, I'm, I'm saying, trying to, trying uh, to be uh, a bit I'm, more logical about this situation. Let me not fuck with that much. Even, even, even to worth, even to um, sorry, my bad. Even to Saint's point, it's worth of uh, to, even to Saint's point of um, what's it um, him um, um, hearing his Nakama um, hear Nami and them and scream um in the up in the next room. That's then damn right. Yes, if, if I hear Nami screaming in the next room. There's two seraphs from here that, that we've got to take care of. There's, there's two four... enemies you don't trust. Just wait, just wait, just wait. Yeah, I'm getting there. There's two enemies I don't trust. There's two set of terraforms here in front of me. Me and the, me and our, my second strongest fighter, me and Zoro, are in the same room, meaning that everybody else is at a disadvantage because Zoro is not with them and he's with me. So nah, they've got Sanji and wait. Jinbei. Like yeah, they have they have Sanji and Jinbei against four seraphims. It's not let's let's not play like we're no, talking. Two like, two other seraphims on the other side. There's two yes there's, with them, and there's, there's two six, other. Though. There's only four in total, no? Okay, so even okay, five. okay, even okay, even even four. Um, Jinbei and Sanji versus two Seraphims is and protecting everybody else is a tough deal. It's not. Let's not act like it's the same as Luffy and Zoro. And okay, same. you're you're proving my point, but carry on. Yeah. Yeah. So so my point on your point is that if I know how dire the situation is, no, I'm not going to spend all my energy when I know that going gear fifth can put me how I will. All your energy. The guy Wait. fought. The, this is one attack. I'm. This is one attack. A Yonko's attack. Conquered with Conqueror's Haki. Are you telling me that's not enough to actually defeat one of the Seraphims? I don't I I'm understand not, how saying... durable, how durable, um, I understand how durable they are because of King's um King's abilities, but that's not enough, boy. Sorry, but I'm, I'm, sorry, I'm, but I'm saying I'm saying saying. I'm saying you keep telling me how strong Luffy's attack is. I'm not right. saying his attack, I'm just, not I'm not just, saying just, Luffy's just attack. Just interject a little bit with this. Mm. Um it's taking a bit of time. So when we're going through the chapter, we're going to have to like skip to the end because if not, we're going to be here till like three o'clock. I'll say my last point on this. I'm, I'm just saying that I'm, I hear Luffy's attack is strong and a direct hit from Luffy's uh, serious Endor. attack should end him. I don't think but I'm, I'm saying it should technically in theory. I think it should. I, I but want it to. But yeah, I think I would want it to. But I'm saying in a sense of the reason I don't think he would do it or be so quick to do that decision is because one, it could get blocked, it could get dodged, different it ain't things. getting blocked. Dodged, uh, I understand. Dodged, fair enough, but it ain't getting I think, blocked. I, I think the Kuma thing can block that with the no. that repel. I, look, that, every character that, no, will that, say, that. listen, every character will say, my ability is this, and use super relatives and say, my ability, you can't do nothing. My light, my light can pierce anything. Remember, remember in Dressrosa when that guy said that his punch could knock out uh, a Yonko, which is, the king that's punch? obviously what, yeah, it, the king it, punch. It's, it's true. That's that obviously was, from you perspective. No, but no it was true. From, how, how do we know that's true? true? Based, based on what we've seen of Kaido, how is that true? That is <laughs> Kaido, true. Kaido would eat that alive, though. He would eat that. He would eat that punch. It's um, not knocking um, him out. Uh, but I'm saying when when it, when you're saying Kaido will eat that punch, one, you're picking Kaido to eat the punch. Fair enough. I'll give you that. Yeah, we, we've but, already know based on the fact that you can't harm Kaido without advanced um hacking. Yeah, I'm saying Before so. That. So so okay, pick another Yonko. I'm saying if that punch, even like, Big Mom, she she's got this heavy 
I would I, I, I would say that I would say that King's punch that's would, interesting. Would, would, would do it's a dent on that. But it's okay, presenting okay. anybody but, that's a but, fact. But okay, my but, point isn't that but, isn't even in presenting anyone. My point is that every character will overhype their ability. They will say, "My ability can do this. You will never be able to do that." But, but, so but what? The, that's just from his but perspective. The, that's from but, their perspective. But 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 there's, but there's also there's also characters that we've seen follow through from their perspective, such as um, Bartolomeo when he says it's an unbreakable barrier. We haven't seen anybody break that barrier yet, and yeah, I don't but, think, I don't think that that barrier will be broken like that. I think, so you think you could break them with AC? I think, huh? You think you could break the barrier with AC or C? I think you I think every character overhyped their abilities. I, I think every character overhyped their abilities. But you think it would uh, crack it? Yeah, I think it, it can be cracked. I think if, it can be cracked. If, if I have AC or C as well. Yeah, so if Luffy was to bang uh, one of the barriers of, of Bart, do you think it would break? I don't um, think it's unbreakable. It's definitely breakable. Um, a lot of arms and arms in it. I lie. Tell me about it. No, I, I, my I, point I, is, I, my I don't, thing, I don't, I, I don't think one hit breaks it. No, I think one hit breaks it. But you I'm know, if, if it's more it cool than one hit that breaks it, that's still very impressive. You know, that, that's what I'm saying. One, that's one, still one very hit, impressive. Multiple, oh. multiple hits break it. That definitely. Me, me, like, one like a punk, like um. I can't lie. Punk, I don't think I'm ever gonna see Luffy do uh an ACLC Gatling. You know. Yeah, that's what it, an ACOC Gatling will break it. You think so? Yeah, ACOC Gatling. I don't, think, I, don't think, I don't think he can do that, though. That's the thing. I don't think Luffy can actually do an ACOC Gatling. He already What's done it, though. He, he did, did to Kaido. It to Kaido with Gear 4. Kaido, bro. That, wasn't yeah. a, that wasn't an ACOC Gatling. That was a real Gatling. No, it was not. No, that no, was no. after he awakened ACOC. He was, no, it, when he awakened ACOC, not every single bang was not an ACOC punch. Yeah, it was. Or else it wouldn't do no damage. No, because Rio does point. damage. No, nah, Rio does damage. Oh, it, it does shallow damage. It doesn't hurt him. It does nah, shallow it does. damage. it does. It hurts him, man. It, it does, does hurt shallow him. damage. He said it him. Bro, bro even the scabbard hurt him. Soft. No, it was and shallow. It, it, was sh it wasn't even strong enough to awaken his old enough. scar. It, it was, was shallow because they weren't. It was so weak, it couldn't even open his old scar. And when Because they weren't strong enough. Not because, not because of the Rio. Yeah, if, the if Rio I, was weak. The worst, the worst yeah, like, number one. And, and Luffy, Rio, and Luffy, Luffy. The reason and why Luffy, I think not every Luffy single Rio punch strong enough. through at Kaido was an ACLC punch is based off what Luffy was based on what Law saying about Haki. If you overuse it, you won't be able to. I don't think every yeah, single we, we already hit, know that. Hold on, hold on. Luffy, I don't yeah, think so. every single hit that Luffy made after you unlocked it would be ACLC. That's kind of that's it, a lot of Haki was. usage. No, but go back and watch it. You'll see. You'll see the effect. I, I was just reading a couple of days ago. You'll see the effect of ACOC on Gear Four whilst he was doing Gatling. I was I was reading it a couple of chapters ago. I'll take a look another time, but yeah, I don't think every single hit was. But I'll take a look just in case maybe I may. After he awakened it, boy, it was. Or else he won't be doing any damage. I, the the I, I the, 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 the real was shallow. He said it himself. All the punch, all the punch, all, all of my punches were shallow. But now I get it. No. You can call your conquerors hacky as well, and then boom. The reason I say it's not because when we see ACLC being used, you can see there's a space between the hits, right? There's a space ACLC, between punch. Oh, no, no, no. It also connects. Since when? I think does it not? Also no, it connect? doesn't. No, no, no. That's, no, what, no, that's what I'm trying to it's say. Just, it's, just, it's just a black and red. It's a black and red flash. When it's AC or C, there's, there's a space. Mm -hmm. But when it's, it's black block, no, no, no. I hear what you're saying, but that's what happened on that chapter. I'm telling you. So if when, when, there's when meant to be a space, that means not every single hit he made was AC or C. Yeah, it no, was. So it was. Where, where, no, AC or C hits can have spaces, but if it's blocked, the space will just be taken up by the other person's AC or C. So it just exactly. Be, It'll just so be black right and now we're just right now there's still no context. facts right now we're just guessing so no one actually really knows I'm, no i'm not i'm not guessing i, I looked no, at I'm saying. a couple of days ago kwami's right oh yeah no, i'm no i'm i'm saying i know of the hits I'm, i don't know of the specific chapter if they actually touched at that moment but i know with Konkrasaki like punches and everything like that they are direct hits but it's just my haki is hitting your haki rather than I'm touching your skin. Yeah, it? exactly, exactly. Sure it's like, I'm, I, yeah, 100%. Yeah, so like, for example, when Kaido and Whitebeard or 
white, oh, sorry, Kaido and Luffy split the sky, they didn't touch each other. It's their hackies that collided of and went up to split the sky. So it's every punch they're hitting, it's like I'm hitting you with my hacky kind of thing. So it's a form of Rio in a way, but it's um, it's a conquest thing. And it's, it's, I think it's, it's a different level. And that That's why is a bit confusing. I guess yeah. because you're not really showing us what the difference is unless both hackies are clashing. The difference is when um, Oda's put Rio in gold and put ACOC in black and red. But not every so, single hit that Luffy made after was in gold. Yeah, because when the gold has come out, so hold on, every so single doesn't that mean so, I was so, right before? See like this. So see, see like this. After the gold hands have come out, every single hit in base form that Luffy was doing, in terms of when you don't see him go and gear forth and expand his hand, every single punch that he's throwing in base form had Rio in it, because he knows that in after that point. He had. He knows that I cannot touch this man without adding then, Rio. That means every single time that Luffy has used ACOC, you have you meant to see gold. No, because ACOC and Rio are two different things. I could use Rio. It's when you used Rio, it was it was red, but ACOC is gold. No, it's the other way around. Rio is gold. Yes. No, it's not. That's what it is. Why, why are you not talking about anime stuff? I'm should be manga based. <laughs> Yeah, but Golden. you're not gonna tell it, 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 because it matters, the matters, it matters. It matters. It matters. In the anime, the anime matters yeah. because you can't it tell it in the manga because, because it's black and it, white. Yeah, it, it matters because that's the only way that they give us the distinction of between. Exactly, that's two. the distinction between the both. It's the only anime, way. Can... Anime, anime don't matter, fam. Black lives matter. Fam. Oh, no, see, no, see, that's that's important though. Is Rio gold or is um? Rio's gold. Yeah, Rio's gold. That's what I was saying. I that means know that if I every know. single hit that Luffy made on Kaido after he's unlocked it, that means every single hit was meant to be gold. But that's not the case. No, that, that's what I'm saying. Because he's unlocked it, they've showed you the gold fist. He's had his special moment. So he's unlocked it. He know, we, The readers, the, the, um, the viewers know that he can use it. We've all seen it. Rio is gold. We know when he's, you know he's using it now. He can touch Rio. Kaido. Oh. So, so see, so see. Um, so see, so that that was just basically the gold hands or whatever was just basically the revelation that now Luffy can touch Kaido. After that point, it's redundant to make his hands well, gold. That means that's point. inconsistent because that's not a fact. That's just what you think it is. No, it's not because I'm saying I'm saying I'm saying it's a fact because uh, I could also say it's not. No, I'm, I'm explaining why. I'm explaining why. No, so what, let me, let me explain what I think you're trying to say, just so I can understand it in my head so every time he's used the gold it doesn't have to stay there we know he's actively using it in into no so no? he's used to no so he's used the gold once yeah okay. he's used the gold once he's used the gold once at a certain point in the fight so the fight the fight has already started the fight has started and gone on for some time he's lost a couple times and come back and this is a power that prior to this fight starting we're waiting for this character to start using this power because this is the only power that this character can use to win this fight. So we have to go into this theory with, the un with that understanding. This is the only power that Luffy can use to touch Kaido. So when Luffy is trying to touch Kaido, he has to use this power. But at this point in time, when the fight has started, we do not know definitively, and we cannot say definitively. We know he's tried it with some rocks in the prison, but we don't know definitively that he can fully use this power in a fight. The gold hands, when they've highlighted that, and they've split the sky with the ACOC, we know when that's been activated. Their hackies clash, we know that, okay, cool. Now they're on the same level in terms of their conqueror's hacky and their output. It's all about who can touch who now. And that's what the fight was leading into when Luffy was losing at the start. When the gold hands have appeared, that's then um, the animators or Oda signifying to the viewers that, listen, now he can use the gold hands. And they've then shown a little 30 second or minute animation of the gold hands being used to say, now Luffy can fist him up. So at that point, from when the gold hands stop being used, let's say in the next clips or the next animation, they pan to law and they go back to Luffy, it's redundant for the gold hands to still be present because they've already had that main stipulation that Luffy couldn't use Rio. Rio's the only thing that can touch Kaido. And at this point now, 
he, he we revealed that he can use Rio, and he, we know that ACFC prior to this arc has been active in terms of Luffy. So now the tools, especially from what Kaido is saying, in which oh the only people after he's seen you use it and seen me affect it, um, seen you affect him, Kaido's then stipulated again, doubled down on the point to say the only people that have ever been able to touch me or do this um this kind of damage to me are these specific people in terms of their hacky only not it's not a fruit thing it's not it's a hacky thing so we know that at this point in time luffy's hacky level has elevated exponentially so from that point every punch that luffy throws we should not have the assumption that he's throwing those punches with prior knowledge or prior experience that he was using in previous fights we should all always have that Thing because they've shown us what he's just unlocked like when they showed us the future set with Katakuri they didn't need to show us he has a red eye especially to know that okay Katakuri's next punch he's going to try and use the future well, he set but he did but every all they had time, to do every time he used the future set we, we knew mm -hmm. using the future set yep but all they had to do because with the future set it was a bit of a cheat code all they had to do with that was just show us the after image before they showed us that i eye think and a the better image. example would be using is just basic observation actually because with basic observation actually we don't know when it's really been yeah fair so, something like that before there was probably i think there was a little part then at the same time someone could also say with the observation Aki, he's not using it at that time and because he's yeah. not using it there's no signification that he's using it so it's i i understand but if someone also, says that that person also, is using it but also even even on that point that's that's even a good segue as well on that point so when luffy and um zoro clocked that green bull was with yamato and lemon already um i think that's that's another that's another um example of the high levels because their observation hack is at such a high level it doesn't need to be emphasized when it's being used so for someone like zoro that is clocking Kaku and Luchi in his sleep, or clocking the attack from Kaku in his sleep and blocking it. It's not that. Oh, you have to show me well, when. Show us to some degree that it's being used. Like they may not actually show a red eye, but they'll show. All right, something's in the air. They'll make a, a face, or they'll turn around and they'll look at the sky. Something like that. That's my point, but that's after it's already been activated. So your your saying is that that that's that's the exact point I'm making. You're saying they don't have to show the exact thing they showed you at the start when they introduced it, but they will always give you a little pointer that it's being used. And in the Kaido fight, the little pointer that is being used was that before the gold hands, he couldn't touch Kaido, and after the gold hands, every single hit was hitting Kaido. So it wasn't that Conqueror's Haki is what is it's not that Conqueror's Haki is what you need. Hold hand, um, to, um, it's not like it's not it's not that Conqueror's Haki is what you need to hit Kaido. You just having Conqueror's Haki is not enough to to um, to, to um to penetrate Kaido. Pause. <laughs> it is, um what's it? Um it, it has to be real. So at every base level, every punch that um, when um, Luffy's doing all out Gatlin, um, um, I hear what you're saying. Like, I hear what you're saying. It, it ha it's just it has to be real. It's not that it's not assuming. It, what are you saying? Real or, or, or conquest? Real, real. It has to be real. That's what there's I was no saying. Other, yeah, there, there's no other way for. Um, Luffy That's what to I was saying. Him. I was saying not every single hit that he's gonna land on Kaido is gonna be A, C, or C, but at the very least, it's probably gonna be real. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. I'm saying every and single then, hit. No, but Worf was saying something inside. different. Worf was saying every single hit he made on Kaido after unlocking ACLC was ACLC, and I was saying it's not. It, what, yeah, in the manga, it's, that's true, though. It's, it's not, the anime, it's in the way, anime, I don't know because I, I ain't watching the anime. There's no way to know in the, in the manga because it doesn't signify if he's using it or not, really. But it does, though, because he's getting hurt. Not, he, was getting, he was getting hurt before. No, but see, I get, I get what Worth's saying. Well, 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 all three of us are saying the same thing. What Worth is saying is that he thinks ACFC is used, especially after that point, because of the degree. I think he's used it sporadically. Just wait, listen, listen, listen. I'm saying Worth is saying he thinks ACFC was used consistently after that point because of the degree in which injuries were being inflicted on Kaido. So he's not saying just for, he's not saying, we're saying, what, what, what me and you are saying is that just for the sheer fact that Luffy's touching Kaido, we already know that Rio is being used. Yeah, I agree with that. Saying, yeah, 
worth it's worth saying he agrees with that but he's saying on top of that he thinks acoc was used after that point because the hits that were being dealt out by luffy had had much more kind of strength to it much more kind of i'm trying to finish this fight kind of i need to put more power so i'm gonna put rio and acoc kind of thing that's what he's saying basically i'm 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 in between saying either one could be true but i know rio was hundred percent. i hear it i hear it i'm just saying i don't think so because i don't think that level of output for every hit to be acoc not saying it's not possible yeah it's unlike i I think it's too much for luffy i think i think that's just too much i don't think every single hit I don't know why the mango showed. Oh, we are, yeah, let's we are. move on. Let's, let's move yeah, let's, on. Let's move on. Let's move on. Are we moving on to the end? Yeah, Is move on end? to the next panel. No, we want to move to the next panel. That's long. Well, let's move on to the end. Yeah, go on. Yeah, because we've discussed this. Yeah. Yeah, so that's my next shackles off. Boom, they've done their thing. Yeah, and look, look, that's, these that's guys, these guys don't panel, look hard. Right, Luffy and uh, Luchi. These guys do not look harmed. Look at that. This is some nice artwork, by the way. I'm just saying. Like, no one really cares about the artwork these days, but that's some nice artwork. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But look, nobody, like, they don't look hurt. Look at them, fam. Look at them. <laughs> don't look look at Zoro's face. This guy looks evil. We all, we all know Oda wanted them, these two guys to have combined attacks. He thought it would be cool. Yeah, that's, cool that's circle. a cool moment. People that were my enemies, <gasps> excuse me, are now... You know, we're not fighting together. I'm not saying they're allies, but we're not fighting together for the same cause. And also another thing I wanted to mention that that I hope I hope this doesn't mean that when Kizaru and them man come, that uh, Luchi and Kaku um, will still end up allies. Basically, I don't want Luchi and Kaku to be allies of the Shore Hats in this arc. I just don't want it. Like I want to keep the the threat to the maximum level. I want I want. I want um, Luffy's crew to look, how do I say it, to be outmatched, if you get what I mean. Like, I want to see what, what can they do. If you have Kizaru, you have Luchi, you have Kaku, you have the Seraphims, all against the Straw Hat crew, and they're trying to defend... Uh, I know that's what you them. want, but you're not going to get it, though. Other than I do. Nah, it is what it is, isn't it? You know, you know what I mean? I just want that threat. Do you get what I mean? I, I don't want there to be a in factions and all of that, uh, that, that you want everyone yeah. on the shore to see how they deal with it yeah i want to see how they deal with it because uh, that's the that's that's threat that's tension and that's what we lacked in one oh and that's what i want to see here you know what i mean yeah, yeah, yeah. that's why I, th- I think we lacked that in one oh i want to see that tension here and it was going that way and then until we have luchi and kaku allying with the shore hat so and then we have like a, a rogue vega pump so all of that twist is all nice and stuff like that Fair enough, but at the end of the day, I still want to see the Seraphim coming against the Straw Hats, and I want, you know, I want Luchi and them lot to still be against the Straw Hats. You get what I mean? So, but we'll see where all the takes. So we'll see where all the takes. Do you guys want to talk about the Vega Punk and all that stuff, or should I go straight to the Shanks? Yeah, just scroll down a little bit. Go straight to the Shanks. So, yeah, so remember when we said that Vegapunk vanished? We sure. didn't know where he was. I know we want to talk about all yeah, the yeah. little parts, but we've been spending too much time talking about, like, a lot. Yeah, yeah, we've got to wrap up in, in a slow. wrap up. In 20 minutes. Yeah, we've got time, we've got time. We'll just we'll wrap up, but we've got time, we've got time. But, um, yeah, Vegapunk, wait, what were you going to say about, about him getting trapped? No, I'm just saying, remember when we thought he vanished, we thought he, he was probably in a different island or something like that, but it turns out, and he himself even doesn't know, that that, me, that means to me, it's definitely one of the Vega parts. you know what I mean, because mm. all of, he said all of this was happening whilst he was around, and who were the only people that was around when he was around? So, the, the, just the quick on the Vegapunk stuff, only until maybe the last chapter or a couple of chapters ago, it looked... Though I I saw there was other people on the island apart from Vegapunk and he's and he's got and he's a uh, satellites. Who's the other people? Like he's just got workers. You know they were holograms, no? No, they, they, he's actually got workers, like actual people there. That's right. Yeah, it's like they're just people on the island. I didn't even know. Um, they're not like holograms. Yeah, like yeah it's not just like the seven of them. Apparently, like there's if you look, there's actual people just on the island, like workers. Yeah, walking, no, no. walking about. Yeah, what the, the fuck? What you might not just hell, just chilling, just working and shit. That's, that's kind of wild. Yeah, man. 
Like these men really just forgot about all these workers and they're going to let the island get blown up or whatever and they don't even care that there's like hundreds of people. Yeah. <laughs> to be fair, it's a very good point. I might be clones or something. Mm. You know, here's your thing. Whose sh- who ships are these, by the way? Because I was confused. I was like, why is there like a polar bear on the thing? Yeah, polar bear and uh, some... I, I thought come. Beppo had like a like a ship or something. I was like, it what? It looks like a jackal. It looks like a jackal. You know those like... Uh, I don't know what jackal was. Like a foxy kind of looking dog. A jackal is like a dog. Hold tight, foxy. Yeah, it looks like a, one of those jackals. Um, but that polar bear, so funny. It, that's definitely the allies of Hold on. Uh, Shanks. Oh, is no? that meant to be Panda Man or something? Yeah. <laughs> that looks like a mm. Panda Man ship. So, um, but I, I think they're just. Yeah, I think the allies of Thingy Shank Screw. Because look behind. Look behind. Yeah, Shanks. they're definitely. Behind is Shanks' ship. Look at that big ship. Uh, shit, oh, yeah, 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 that's true. Oh, shit, yeah, I didn't true. even that's see true. that. <laughs> I did not even see that. Yeah, that's wild, that's wild. And we've got another look, we've got another look. Oh, no, oh, yeah, to be fair, it might just be random people at the bar, you know. Yeah. It's out of bar. We've, we've got another Luffy, we've got another Luffy. Yeah, he yeah, might, yeah. You think he might become the he might become important yeah, later on. Yeah, it's twenty years yeah. time. Do a time skip, and then we have another leaf, and it's gonna be a giant. And this one's gonna be a giant. He might be even a D. So hold D, on, is, are these things giants? Are these people giants? I think so. Look at it. I think. Yeah, so. Elba. Yeah, I mean they're in the Elba. Do you know if they're you know, giants? They're, they're yeah, like I shouldn't be a reviewer because I had no idea. I mean, they're in the Elba. I am dumb. Oh, yeah, they are. Look, look at what yeah, they're they wearing. They, they're they're wearing the helmet. The helmet. Uh, yeah. Look at the helmet. Nah, but I thought this were regular people. I thought this thing was like full foot. <laughs> no, 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 no. This, this one, it was, it was definitely on your ship still. Oh, man. I didn't even know. Prince is missing his face. Shanks is saying, don't be so dumb. Anymore. There's no way. He was talking to me. I'll bring a hot headed kid like you, fam. This is literally Luffy's backstory. Hmm. <sighs> One-on-one, fam. By the way, the transition between the straw hats and this was bad. But, whatever. In what way? What do you mean? Sometimes with the way Oda does panels, you can't really tell what's going on. You just... The transitions aren't nah. well sometimes. You just, gotta, you, you just gotta focus. If you focus, you can easily tell what's happening. I'm not focusing. Yeah, that's exactly my point. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly my point. So Rockstar comes and gives Shanks a message that killer, I mean, kid is attacking them. Oh, so they've been beefing their, their youngsters. Oh. Yeah, they're, they're, they're basically outside fighting the youngies, isn't it? Yeah. And then more just inside drinking. So these lot came and just like, yeah, they, you know, they're, they're not like, they're not outside been waiting for you. you know? they're, trying to, they're, trying to, they're trying to see you. Because obviously last time kid didn't even see Shanks and he lost his arm, so. Apparently he didn't even see Shanks. So number one, we know it was definitely not Shanks who, who yeah. cut his arm. Because he could have was saying it was Ben Beckman. Yeah, Daryl yeah. said it might have been Beckman. But Daryl was saying that based off what... Um, what the, said to, the conversation. Yeah, what Shanks said, to, Shanks said to Beckman. But I think he was saying that... Daryl said he was dipping or something. Yes. Did he say he was leaving? He's still on the chat. This guy's playing PlayStation. Huh? All right, carry on. But um, yeah, yes. Yeah. So I I think what um what he said to Beckman was based off what Beckman said to him. Yeah, look like just there. Go down a little bit. Yeah, yeah. So like um, lost track of time. All that, all that. And like enemy's gonna be pissed at you for keeping them waiting. Then he started laughing that like, you can't talk back. Do you think he's um the only one they're mad at? Okay. So, that's what Lucky Roo said. So Daryl interpreted that to think, oh, maybe Beckman took his arm. That's why he's mad. But I think Lucky Roo said that because he's telling Beckman, like, nah, Beckman's saying they're going to be mad at Shanks for keeping him waiting. But Lucky Roo's saying, nah, Beckman, they're waiting for you as well to come beat them. Like, <laughs> kind of thing. Both of you keeping them waiting. Mm. Keep then, going, keep going. Mm-mm. 
man so let's set sail so obviously they're, they're not trying to not trying to bring the beef to the island and that never let it become a war zone it's a dory Brogy. Hmm. madness no for a second when i saw this here i was thinking hold on they're rolling with shanks like that i forgot they were on elbow for a second i swear dead man's were in little garden yeah 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 Two years ago, they were in Little Garden. Mm. Now they're yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, now, now they're nothing. Now they're chilling. But um, Mad story. Yeah, keep going down. Keep going down. I don't know. I don't know who this one is. Um, I don't know who this yeah is. I keep shouting from that. I like. Said, keep going. Just, just shouting up and down, man. Like chill. Sure. It's a mass panel. What's it? That is a nice panel. Oh yeah, yeah, lip panel. But what, John? How, how did you not know there were giants when you? Oh, leave me, leave, leave me on that one, that one. That one. Yeah. <laughs> can't, can't you see standing next to him? I'm <laughs> dumb. <laughs> that's the that's the same kid, you know. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. I don't know. Because, you know, it's like sometimes they just be drawing them out of scale, and you just can't tell. Nah, say, I'm dumb. Saint, um, Saint is right, so you need to focus. Yeah, I'm dumb. I'm dumb. Hmm, I said he has a choice. He can either hand over his low toning glyph robins and scram. He can die from. Man said he could either hand over his road pony glyph and bounce. Mm. <laughs> He's flexing. Uh, Every yeah. time I see a rock star, this guy is just. This guy's I'm a lie, this panel is such a flex. Man. Yeah, and he's, and he's happy to be a stand up. I mean, he's a stand up with a pirate of the world. Yeah. Even after two years, yeah, at least he became a Yonko. My man is still a sender. <laughs> yeah, and he still has no ratings. <laughs> what was his bounty when we first saw him? Was that like 80 million or something? Right? It was like 190, he sat in million, fam. Who? Swear, was that like 190. I thought it was like 80 like, million. Was above, I think it was above 100. I can know. He was like sure. a, I know that he really he was like oh, okay. a rookie. I feel like, I feel like 88 or something like that. Yo, that panel looks tough. Yeah, it's so, a good panel. Oof. Man said, hand over your road pony glyph or scram. So, bets going in. What was Rockstar's bounty? Here? Going once, going twice. Rockstar's bounty, I'll say 95 because they're not 80 yet. I'm not sure. you know, I'm even going to ask oh, my Kwame guys. It's, nine. it's 94. 94? Yeah. yeah. Look at what I've said, 100 is shot, man. I knew, I knew no, man. It's, it's been two years, fam. He, he should have a bounty increase by now. Come on. No, I said yeah, at the time. I didn't say now. Yeah, definitely increased now. 100% he increased now on the Yonko Cruise. Now it's might. 96. Yeah, now, now it should be like 500. Now it's 96, man. There's a nobody. Who, not now? It's a 96. Nah, man. If you're delivering messages for Shanks, you got to have an extra 200 mil boost. Who do you think Shanks is? Or he can recite a mini I, I think he is who you think he is, fam. I can't argue with that. Shanks, yeah, man. <laughs> what? <laughs> Let me see this. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oof. So those ships on the horizon. When I said on the horizon, you know. All you can see is his ships. It's all you see. Yeah, you, you can see You can see those far ships away. Right see the ones lagging behind. I can't believe this guy is actually crazy enough to roll up on a Yonko with his allies and with his mate. Yo, like, how is Kid going to actually win this fight? <laughs> what, what, what's, um, what's confusing to me here is what? The kid just come with one ship. He's only got one ship from what we know of. And they ain't sunk this man yet. <laughs> and all, all of them, all of Shanks' allies, they're what? big shots. He even said, he says it himself. They're all big shots. You shouldn't even be able to see Shanks in yeah. the film. Unless Shanks actually challenges him to a, to a fight, then I would understand. But as it stands, I don't know how he's even going to cut through all of them, man. Do you know what's funny? Kid is out mm -hmm. here saying, I lost my arm. He's even holding his arm. And the kid is laughing. <laughs> <laughs> no, kid, Killer said that, not Kid. What? 
Killer said, Killer's explaining to him that, La, that yo, this is about to be deep, you know. So Killer's talking. Killer said, fam, they're uh, all alive. Oh, no, no, you're right. I was talk I'm talk. i talking about this part here where Kid is saying that all allies of red haired pirates, everyone off, every one of them is, seems to be a big shot. Like, no, nah, it's, right, it's, right. it's not Kid. Kid's yeah. not, it's Killer talking. Yeah, it's Killer, it's Killer. It's Killer, it's Killer talking. The whole thing is Killer. See, I don't be focusing, so, you know. Yeah, yo, what? And that, that's why that's why he was like last time it was completely one sided. They took your arm. No, that's why they loved it. Before we even, yeah, before we even got a glimpse. No, nah, it's the free. I don't um, care, man. This shit is funny. Yeah, my, my. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nah, see the next line. See the next line. They won't settle for an arm this time. Yo. Look at the way they onto this guy. Uh, I'm thinking, why they, why they so, why, why they so onto man? Dead bitches on him, man. I'm thinking, why they, no, nah, but why they so onto man, dude? A lie? <laughs> They're onto man. I'm thinking, yo, like you never, you never fuck with the bitches. Hold on, like that. are these girls around the giants or what? <laughs> yeah, man. You got the big bitches. Of course they're giants. What do you mean? Hey, you man. How do you think yeah. you you clap a, a giant girl's cheeks? What? Huh? You know, She's your what? You might go a lot cut now. A lot cut now. Give it two minutes. Tell me to chill. No, no, baby. <laughs> send that. Send that. Hey, right. what? Send that. Go. Just what? Just me and you. What? Oh, he cut. Yeah, it's cut. Yo, how uh, only for me? Wait, go, go up again. Yeah, hold it, hold. It. Oh, I think Killer's still talking. Like this time, they will take more than just your arm. They will take your life. Yeah, yeah, Killer's still talking. So you see, you see, they won't settle for an arm this time. They'll take your life. I think Killer's still talking. And go down, go down. And that's literally the final. That's basically it. And then Kid finally replies, yeah, 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 only if I lose. You know what would be good? Help. If Help. all the actors yeah, just leave us like... what happens after, because when we saw Law versus Blackbeard, I didn't think we would actually see the clash. And then he showed the clash. But that's all That's all he's been doing, showing clashes. Yeah, that was good. That we saw like Law and Blackbeard actually fight. I didn't think we would see it. But we didn't we saw... actually see fight it was only a clash it was more than a clash nah it was just like cool let me stab you and then cool let's clash that's, that's more it. Than a clash nah that was still nothing it was something but you know what i mean but yo kid versus shank fam like <laughs> so the thing is the way i see it is <clears throat> what's the point of kid losing again do you get what i mean like he's already lost one he's, and he's gonna lose face he's gonna win no it's, just hear me out what's the point it's a bit redundant if this time he loses do you get what i mean if kid loses again here you know people are gonna shit on him. you know he's already had bad reputation already that's number yeah, one I mean, his reputation his reputation is in shambles. Yes, he helped defeat. It's Big not in Mama. shambles, but it's not great. It was, it was until he helped defeat Big Mom of Law. But still, he's far behind Luffy. His strength compared to Luffy is literally, yeah, you know what I mean. But you know, for me, Kid didn't help to defeat Big Mom. To me, it was all law. I'm not gonna lie to you, man. Nah, come on. <laughs> <laughs> Nah, he didn't do anything. Nah, stop. Uh, stop, stop that. He put in words. I I rate what Law did more, but you gotta still put respect no, in I his do. name. In no, it. I do not. You know what I mean? You still gotta put respect in his name. I'm sorry, I can't. You have to. I can't. Like, he he put he put in words. Lord Lord defeated Big Mom by himself for so long. Stop tapping, fam. But anyway. What do you think? Do you think this is actually going to happen? Um, the thing is, he's not going to Shanks just to get beaten because it doesn't, narratively speaking, it's a bit. It makes sense. It's gonna. Exactly. There's gonna be something there. Whether it's they 
I don't know. There's just going to be something that's not just a, a just a simple loss because it's just too flat. Um, there's going to be more. I, I don't know what it could be. I doubt it's um, an allied um, attempt, obviously. Um, another option could be... To be honest, I don't know. Honestly, I actually don't know right now. I'm not going to... True, but here, here, are, here are the options. Though. Well, give me the options. They don't actually fight. They're coming to some agreement. And they don't actually fight. So that way, kid doesn't look bad. Because I don't see how kid loses here and he goes and looks bad. It just doesn't yeah, make yeah, sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But then you have so to ask as well. But it's is, Shanks we're talking about. What here. is kid's motive right now in terms of Elbaf? What's his, what's his business? He's here to collect a road problem. That's his motive. Is that his motive, yeah? Yeah, because that's he was heading to so Elbaf. I'm assuming... For the, the what's going to happen has to do something to do a raw polyglyph. I don't know what that is right now. Yeah. So either kid gets a win-win, or either this, it's a win-win situation for both. Shanks doesn't look bad. You know what? I want bad. Shank. I want kid to get a W, but it may not be a W in terms of fighting. But he needs to get mm. some form of a W. Exactly. You know what I mean? I'll actually be. I don't even really. I don't dislike kid. I. I think he's an all right character. I just don't think he's that strong right now, anyway. Um, but but I want to see for me, some form of a double. I think I don't think that makes Shanks look bad, depending on how it that, happens, anyway. But you need to give fans, Kid some form of fans, a double. Fans will go wild if Shanks loses against Kid here. But for me, I don't care if Shanks loses against Kid here. You know what I mean? I I don't really care because if Luffy from the beginning of one off can be defeated by Kaido and then at the end he ends up that that massive power up so so can kid this is kid's opportunity to get a c o c this could be his opportunity to get a c o c no big man saying this could be his opportunity to get a c o c but but this is why I don't want kids to beat Shanks because Shanks is reserved for Blackbeard that's the fight that must happen because it's already been set up I keep saying and I'll say it again. If Shanks and Blackbeard don't fight, I'm quitting One Piece temporarily. <laughs> yeah, no, for real. You hear that? Yeah. I'm quitting it temporarily. You've said that Cause... before so many times, man. Yeah, because you can't bait us with them two fighting and then you don't give it to us. Because this, this was set up from time ago do you get what i'm saying yeah so if you go about saying you think it's a good thing to 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 um what's it called to subvert expectations and try to have kids defeat shanks yeah something you haven't set up or something you have set up but you haven't set up as much as you set up the shanks versus blackbeard yeah i would temporarily quit one piece big man thing so that's the thing. Shanks can't lose because he's reserved for Blackbeard. Because the setup is there. My mistake, what? brother. I was trying to do something. It was my mistake. Yeah. You hear what I'm saying? So here, here's the situation, fam. Kid can't... He could lose, but he can't look bad, bad. So he can... He can maybe not lose the fight. Maybe lose the fight, but still get what he came for. So it's a win-win for him. Mm. You know, so it's a lose-win. So he... He wins, he gains something even though he loses the fight. But it would actually be sad if he loses the fight. That's more important. Do you get what I mean? He shouldn't oh, yeah. lose the fight. I'd rather that I'd rather that he wins the fight and doesn't get the pawn again. Rather than getting the pawn again and lose the fight. Because that's all fans care about. Yeah. Him 
getting that W. But the thing is, Shanks can't be defeated because he's reserved for black pit. Did you hear what I'm saying? I hear what you're saying. So, Odo is playing games. Odo is playing games. It's interesting to see what will happen because it is interesting to we see know he, if he loses in an actual fight, we know that's a waste and we know that's a bit too flat. So it has to, he has to mix it up. He has to switch it up depending on what the motives are, which we know is time to be upon the list. We don't know how it's really going to go. It's the same thing with Law and Blackbeard, to be honest, because we don't know what the conclusion is to Law and Blackbeard. Um, yeah, but we already know Law is Law. Not necessarily, but at the same time, yeah. He could escape. He could escape. He could have escaped, but we know they had a fight. We saw a little bit of the fight, but we know Blackbeard is chilling on his island and yeah, we don't we know what know happened that. with Law. We also know Blackbeard will do anything to get that pole. We know Blackbeard so, will do anything. <clears throat> but the kid versus Shank fight, nobody saw it coming, even though we should have. Because it was set up. Coming, it? We should have, because it was set up. You know, they both have red hair. They both have a um, scar on the same place they're both missing arms you know what i mean i didn't um, even clock all of that i'm not even gonna lie to you yeah but what i'm saying is those things yeah they're just they're just sort of like um what would you call them uh they're, they're nothing really compared to the setup that's been there there's it's nothing compared to the emotional impact that it would have for blackbird when he defeats shanks I that's more important for me than than kid getting this W. But the thing is, kid can't lose either because if he loses again, you know fans are gonna shit on yeah. him. Do you get what I mean? Because not They're saying gonna... that kid is more important than Shanks in the story, but he's meant to be. A, he's meant to be important to the. Meant to, how do I explain the... it? Look, see, as one of Luffy's rivals, exactly, yeah. he's meant like, to be we that know guy. Shanks is important, but we know he's meant to be a bit more of an afterthought. Or maybe I'm explaining it a bit wrong, but I think just you know a, what I'm trying to say. Yeah, yeah, he's just the guy from an older he's, yeah. he's important. He's from the old era, guy. but the new era oh, is yeah. these men need to do something. You know what I mean? So, that's what I'm saying. Maybe they clash, but Maybe they clash and nothing no, happens. If, if they clash and, sh- and, and and kid don't die, I have to give them a little bit of raise there. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I I think they go, they're going to clash, right? But the fight won't finish. No one will get okay, hurt. I'm, I have to give Shanks raise will probably, to him. Shanks will probably recognise kid's, kid's strength. Do you get what I mean? He'll recognise kid's strength or something like that. And it's a win-win situation for both. Nobody looks bad. Shanks fans don't get pissed off, even though I don't care. You know <laughs> what I mean? Not for real, but Shanks, Shanks is reserved for Blackbeard. Shanks is Blackbeard's booty. I knew you were going <laughs> to say that. I was waiting for you to say that. I was waiting for that. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> Shanks be looking at Blackbeard, fam. You know what I mean? Like, so with the kids versus Shanks, I don't like. I see the theme there. I see them both not having um blah blah blah. Like I don't care that that set up that was set up in um that was set up in the new world. Mm. But Blackbeard versus Shanks that was set up before. These guys are, you know what I mean, and the emotional impact that it that it would have on Luffy, you know what I mean. So, yeah. but kids can't lose. He can't lose. He can't lose. He can't lose. But but, but Oda can throw the Blackbeard versus Shanks away. So that means Shanks loses. I would rather Kid bam. I would rather Kid wins for his sake. Because I don't really like Shanks. You know what I mean? Because he's overhyped. You're lucky that Kwame's not here. And then number two is, but I don't want Shanks to die in the hand to, to lose against Kid because he belongs to Blackbeard. <laughs> <laughs> what a Blackbeard dilemma, fam. You know what I mean? What a dilemma. Do you get know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah. That's my thoughts, fam. 
Yeah, let me call the, let me stop recording now. Got five minutes left.